Pause champ, you guys want to... You want to start Pokemon? I'll, ex I'll explain more, but um, if you want to. <laughs> uh, Lilith Neo Moreau, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Catarot, thanks for the 300 bits. Thank you. Um, okay. Let me open it. Hopefully it works. I didn't test any of this before I streamed, which is like the biggest flaw I have as a streamer. I just kind of say I do things and they magically work. There it is. Okay. Oh, that's a little loud. Just a little loud. Oh, that's so loud. It's a banger though. Okay, it's a banger. I'm digging it. Uh, I can make it bigger, one sec. Uh, options. Screen size, there it is. Okay. All right, you guys wanna start? <laughs> I mean, I could, I could, wait, let me see if I can start a second instance of it so I can play the music in the background. Okay, there it is, okay, sick. <laughs> oh my god. Um, The Blind Bandit, thanks for the Prime Gaming. How does that sound? Is that good for sound? I'm digging it. Oh yeah, okay. A bit higher, okay. Is that good? Uh, I'm talking during it, it's happening, things are going. Oh, we're going, we're doing it, it's happening. Pokemon Infinity with twitch.tv slash point crow. This is actually like a banger though, Wait, what the fuck? Hello, thanks for the two months. Um, a little bit m more you, okay. I'll put it in the middle there. Is this gonna be an infinite stream? No, that's the subathon. <laughs> So a subathon, in case you don't know what a subathon is, um, essentially um, I'll stream uh, an hour, you sub, and if you sub, uh, I'll add 30 minutes to the clock, uh, 30 seconds to the clock, and uh, yeah, that's kind of how you know. And then I'll stream until the timer runs out. Um, but we have a little twist as well. I'm not going to tell you guys what the twist is, but we have a twist that's uh, a little bit different than like you see, like Link is doing a subathon. You see, like uh, CJ did a subathon. Um, uh, a bunch of other people have too, right? Uh, Ludwig Subathon too. We're doing something a little bit different that makes it unique. Um, when does he play Breath of the Wild? Wow, yo, new record. Let's go. We haven't even gotten into the game. <laughs> Sorry, that's funny. All right. Um, all right. Uh, I'll be playing Breath of the Wild on Wednesday, by the way. Um, so, okay. Uh, Chillin' Sicilian. Thanks for the two months. Uh, let's get into it. This is Pokemon Infinity, a Pokemon fan game, uh, that I saw A-Rex play. He's another streamer. You should go check him out. He's actually great. Um, I saw A-Rex play, and, um, what I'll probably do, uh, is, well, we'll see. We'll see, we'll see if this is, uh, good, like, uh, um, Pokemon Uranium and everything. All I saw was the art style, and I really liked it, and then also... Um, I really, uh, I, I liked the, the little like one sentence blurb of like, you're on an Island and you wake up, <laughs> which is so generic, but I was like, all right, let's, let's get into it. It just looks good. You know? Um, okay, here we go. New game. And it's also, also, when does he play breath of the wild? My guy, I just answered that question. Okay. So it seems like you're actually deaf. Good to know. Um, <laughs> um jesus christ all right i just want to answer those questions then if you don't even listen to me uh okay so it's really fun for these things uh if uh we get really into it <laughs> if we get really really into it you know uh rude come on man i i don't want to start streaming like this um sorry uh but yeah it's really fun if we get like really really into it and everything um and just like really just embrace the story um, all right, let's get into it. Hey, wake up. Come on, kid. Wake up. 
Uh, we'll be right here with you until you wake up. Can you hear that, by the way, chat? Is that like, is that like good volume? Yeah, okay. Their eyes. They're waking up. Be careful, stand back. Can you hear me, child? No. We have a funny one on our hands, okay. <laughs> Let me test your memory. Tell me, child. Do you remember anything about yourself? Uh... I'm a grill. I see. Whoa. Dude, this is pretty. This is really pretty. Whoa, kiddo. Take it easy. You can get woozy if you get up too fast. Do you remember your name? Uh, yeah. <laughs> wait, wait. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Hey chat, what's our name? <laughs> I'll never I guess we'll never know. Link uh of Asgard, thanks for the four months. Welcome back. Grill? Alright, grill it is. Dilfo, thanks for the six months. Welcome back. So you're Grill. I am, yes. Well, Grill, my name is Professor Wormwood. This is my assistant Lucy. Given that this is no place to recover, we'll escort you back to town. You were brought to a nearby town and laid to rest. You fell back asleep for several hours. I'm kind of digging the music. Oh, look at this art style, though. Wait, this is, like, so sick. <laughs> this is so sick. Oh, I've also, um... Um... Okay, yeah, that... This this is a sink, chat. Look, it's a... A clean oven range. Too bad you have nothing to cook. It's a... Look, it's a sink. <laughs> That's yeah, crazy. Oh my god. Art style, it's pixels. If you think art style, it's pixels, um, pixel art also has a style to it. There's multiple styles to pixel art. It's not just uh, pixels. A little bit different. Um, but it's really cool. I, li I like the style of it. Um, I know I do art too. Well, yeah, you know, like it's just, it's, it bangs, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, okay. Um, so yeah, uh, this seems interesting. I also want to say I added two new emotes to chat. Um, one of them is uh, Bedge, uh, and the other one is uh, Woke, which uh, use as you will. Uh, it's Bedge and Woke. It's a note. Read it. Yes. Grill, hopefully you'll read this when you wake up. I'll be in my lab. Please stop by. It's the big building up on the hill. Wormwood. Yeah, so we know nothing about what's going on here. Whoa. This is pretty. Uh, I can't run yet. Uh, or at least I don't know how to run. Oh, that's the run button. Okay. Um. Whoa. This is cool. Okay, so I need to I need to change my controls a little bit if you don't mind. So this will be Z, and this one's going to be Escape. Okay. Uh, Reaper Reaper's all seeing eye. So if I want to run, I do this. Okay, and then if I want to go to menu, yeah. Look, that's us. Uh, looks like there's only five badges in this uh game, I guess. Cool. This is completed, by the way. I checked to see if it was completed. Um, but it looks like there's only five badges. I wish I could swim across the pond. It looks like there's a cave over there. Oh, okay. I kind of like the, the sound, too. It's like, it's like nice. Um, good thing the professor was out on a daily, his daily hike through the Genesis Forest. Something bad could have happened if they hadn't found you when they did. So we woke up in the Genesis Forest. You'll see the kid that the professor, my daughter, helped out. Good to see you're okay. My daughter Lucy works with Professor Wormwood. I guess they're expecting you. Cool. It's like jammies. It really is jammies. <laughs> oh, what's up, Lucy? Hey, over here. Uh, it's me, Lucy. Oh, look at look at the right here. Oh, that's so sick. Uh, it's me, Lucy. I was one of the people who helped you out of the forest. 
I think Professor Wormwood wanted you to stop by when you got up. Who? <laughs> professor Wormwood? Hmm, you must not be from around here. He's the professor here in Ego. Lego my Ego? Uh, in Ego, he studies Pokemon and stuff. Or at least he used to. He's getting a little bit less ambitious. Uh, ambitious. Uh, or at least he... I can't speak today. Holy shit. Um. <clears throat> Or at least he used to. He's getting a little less ambitious in his old age. Follow me. I'll bring you up to his lab. Interesting. Okay. Words. Okay. You know, I, I'm learning how to do English for the first time. This is the professor's lab. Feel free to look around. He's waiting on you. Uh, he's waiting for you on the other side of the room. Take your time, though. I'm sure he's in no rush. And don't mind the mess. The professor can get lost in books pretty quickly. I yeah, know. It's Lego my ego. I'm just saying, you know, the Ego region. Uh, the professor wants me to study this book. What good is knowing what species are native around the area? I don't care about catching Pokemon. I just want to study them. Suppose you need to catch them to study them. That makes sense. Uh, constant data entry is mind-numbing, but a necess uh, necessity for scientific progress. Um, hell yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know if this is rival or love interest. I don't know about Lucy at all. Um, the funny thing is I literally don't know anything about this game. So we're going to be learning it together. I don't know literally anything. So I'm excited. Uh, but no spoilers, please. No spoilers. In case you have played this on the off chance. Yeah. Um, I help the professor with the more modern aspects of Pokemon research. He's a little more old school. We strike a nice balance that way. What's up, Professor Wormwood? Ah, uh, yes, Grill. Ah, oh, yes, girl. Oh, so glad to see you. <laughs> so glad to see you up and moving around. Surely you're feeling better by now. I was hoping I could talk to you for a bit before you inevitably went on your way. Please follow me and we can enjoy fresh air. Lucy! Do you need something, Professor? Yes, thank you. Can you coordinate what we discussed earlier? Professor Wormwussy? Don't. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> it's been six minutes and you've ruined this game for me already <laughs> it's, it's, it's you literally thanks for that hate, hate that you know oh my god uh i'll have them ready in a jiffy thank you lucy come with me grill whoa i've lived here for a long time grill i've met hundreds of people all the characters you can imagine have crossed paths with me here in Echo. Adventurers, trainers, breeders, business people, farmers, even people from completely different regions. The thing is, Echo is a small island region. When someone new touches foot here, there isn't a soul on the island that isn't made aware in under a day. So why does no one know who you are? We found you in the forest with nothing but what you have on you. No tracks, no records of any planes or boats coming or going for weeks. I've called around the region and no one seems to have any idea who you are. Why do you think that is? <laughs> Great options here. I don't know or no idea. <laughs> I don't know. That's what I was afraid of. No memories to help solve this mystery. Let me ask you, do you know what a Pokemon is? No, what is that? Fascinating. Either your memory is having a major lapse in retention, or you're from a place that I've never heard of. Do you guys know what Pokemon is? I, I don't. I, it, Pokey, Pokemans? P uh, poke, Pokemon? Never heard of it. Poke what? Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Uh, Pokemon are amazing creatures that have intertwined themselves with our world for thousands of years. I've never heard of someone who doesn't know what a Pokemon is. This is my Pikachu. We've been partners for years. My Pikachu has protected me over and over again on many adventures. I believe that in order for you to figure out why you're here and where you came from, you're going to have to traverse this island. It wouldn't be wise to do that without a partner of your own. Let's return to the lab. I have three Pokeballs behind me that contain young and inexperienced Pokemon. Like I said, if you're going to be traveling around the island, you're going to need a partner to protect you. So please, Grill, go ahead and take a look. Okay, so what I'm hearing is, so basically, we have woken up on this island region with no memory of how we got there or why we're there. And nobody else knows 
why we're there either. We've just woken up randomly on this island in the middle of nowhere. Interesting. Alright, so who is our starter Pokemon? We want Bulbasaur, the Cactus Ball Pokemon. Oh, what? N no, okay. Do you want Charmander, the Flare Lizard? Oh, wait, these are so cool. Or Squirtle, the Rain Cloud Pokemon. Okay, so we have to choose between a cactus. <laughs> uh, a, 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 a torch. And a cloud. Alright, what do we want, chat? Um, I wonder if I could, like, set up a... Uh, mods, can we do a poll on Twitch? Um, does Charmander have hair? It kind of looks like Charmander has hair. But Charmander, honestly, I'll say this. Actually, wait, 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 mods, mods. Uh, before we do the poll, can you do it between the cactus and the cloud? I'm gonna just, like... I, we're not choosing Charmander for this. <laughs> it, it, Charmander... It, it just, it doesn't look like an interesting sprite to me, you know? Alright, uh, let me see if we can, uh, do... Alright, um, which starter chat? Go vote. Go vote. Go vote. It's, uh, it's closing. Thanks so much for a poll point, Crow. You're welcome. I got you. All right, it looks like... Ooh, okay, so it's 40-60 right now. If you vote, you can change the... the can change how it is. <laughs> it's either cactus or squirt or, or cloud. Cla cactus or cloud. But you gotta pick one. It's kind of close. Also, if you want to follow the stream uh, right now, you'll see your name on screen. So, I'll keep it open for a hot second. How does that work every time? It's like a, it's literally like a, it's like a hack, you know? <laughs> we were all seeing hi, thanks for giving a sub. Appreciate it. Um, Alright, sick. So it looks like Cloud Squirtle has won. Follow baiting. It's a great idea. It works so well. <laughs> Alright. Cloud Squirtle it is. The Rain Cloud Pokemon. Yeah, that's interesting. I like it. Would you like to give it? What do we name it? Um, maybe something like, like a, like a cloud name. Cumulus. Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> it has come in it, chat. So we'll, it'll, we'll pronounce it cumulus, but we'll all know together that it's actually cumulus. Did I spell it? Wait, did I spell it right, chat? Oh, it's, it's just like with a US. Okay. A fine choice, Grill. I trust you and your new partner will get along great. With the Pokemon at your side, you should be able to explore the island in search of answers. You should visit an old colleague of mine who lives northeast of here. They run the lighthouse. If anyone can help you figure out how you got here, it's going to be them. Their name is Professor Thorn. They're one of the smartest people I know. Don't tell them I said that, though. It'll go to their head. I'm going to give you one of these as well. It's a Pokedex. It'll help you keep track of the other Pokemon you meet. Nice. Uh, it's Fox Tato. Thanks for the five months. Here's a handful of items that will aid you on your journey. A variety of healing items and a town map. Good luck, Grill. Remember, you can always rest in my guest house, and you can always come for us to help. I wish you the best. All right, so we have to find out what the hell our memory is. A note with Sylphco. Oh, okay. Yeah. 
Dear Professor Wormwood, we have received a request for introductory Pokemon Trainer Package and have submitted it for processing. As soon as our offices have confirmed the order, our field agents will be dispatched to catch the requested amount of Bulbazar, Charmander, and Squirtle and have them promptly and humanely shipped to you. Estimate deliveries between 6 and 12 weeks. You'll be notified of any changes to your order. Best regards, Sylphco. Oh, that's cool. That's sick. Also, Sync, by the way. Oh, and look, there's a painting of some sort of glittery bird and a rainbow. A large refrigerator that sounds relatively hollow when knocked on. That's literally mine, yeah. Beer is off. Monitor has a light layer of dust on its surface. A cluttered desk full of recently printed paper and dense literature. And a bed. Veg. <laughs> Yeah, so what I'm... So... He says that we didn't... He's prepped these. I don't know if, like... Does he know? Like, 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 like... he The Sylphco thing said, like, Oh, hey, we, we want a shipment of these Pokemon. Does he, like... It could be for, like, I don't know, Lucy over there. But it's possible that, like... He knows us and shipped Pokemon 6 to 12 weeks ago in anticipation for us. I'm a little suspicious of that, but we'll continue on. Professor Wormwood doesn't seem to be all, uh, all nice. I I'll give him the benefit of the doubt, though, but I am a little wary. There's nothing like having a partner by your side. Teamwork can help you tackle any obstacle. Uh, I'm also going to, like, read all the dialogue for these people, just because I think it's going to be, like, there's going to be some fun stuff. You say it's a mystery how you got here. Does anyone really know how they got where they are? Do you remember the beginning of your life? I think my first memory was, like, when I was four, and I was sitting at a table. The news is on. Would you like to listen to the weather forecast with a news story? Uh, the weather forecast. Thanks for tuning in. This is your Monday weather briefing. The weather today in the Hayda Sea Ridge District will begin with the clear skies and stay that way into the middle of the day. Into the evening, we'll see moonlight peaking through the clouds. Tomorrow looks like it'll start out clear and then get sunnier as the day continues. That's it for the daily report. Thank you for depending on Hayesport News for your daily weather. Nice. Uh, a chance of cumulus clouds. An urgent report comes from us today for the mayor of Hasport City. Hayesport City. The mayor has received a call from Professor Wormwood of Hades Town, looking for help in any way that she or the people of Echo can provide. According to Professor Wormwood, him and his assistant found a missing person in Genesis Forest who claims to not remember anything about how they got there. We were able to sketch out an approximate likeness of the person based on the description given by the professor. If you know or recognize this person, please report anything you can to the proper authorities so that we can all help our guest friend find their way home. Interesting. Beat the guy. Thanks for the one year. Thank you. I hope you're having a wonderful day yourself. Isn't technology incredible? Our technology has been advancing exponentially for years. On a long enough timeline, logic will dictate that we will be able to create lifelike simulations. Nah, that'd be crazy. That would be crazy. Oh, hey there. Uh, I was just saying goodbye to my dad. I'm on my way to the professor's lab. Oh, sorry. My name's Teal. I'm going to get a, a Pokemon for Professor Wormwood and train it to be the strongest around. Oh, so he's like our rival. Uh, it's been my dream since I was a real young. I can't wait to finally begin my journey. Anyway, time to fulfill my fate and take on the Ego Council Challenge. What's that? Oh, you don't know? Uh, the Ego Council Challenge is where you go around Ego and battle each member of the Ego Council. They are some of the strongest trainers in Ego and help maintain and contribute to life here on the island. So it seems like these, it's like the gym leaders, basically. The council. If you beat them, they give you a badge in honor of your victory. I better head off. I hope to see you around. Okay. Interesting. That seems so sick. What if the island's a simulation? Bro. Hey, you look like a young, ambitious trainer. My kid doesn't want this Pokemon egg. Would you like to have it? Oh. Yeah. Sh sure. Okay. We just got an egg. Oh, with a flame on the bottom? What the hell? Can I offer an egg in this trying time? Uh, mysterious egg Pokemon. Okay, so this is Squirtle. It's a water type still. 
Uh, mild nature, somewhat stubborn. And there's overcoat. Protects the Pokemon from damage from weather. Okay. <laughs> Look at those IVs, though. Sheesh. Name, name a better duo than, than Point Crow and dog shit stats. <laughs> oh, God. Yay! The suffocating potato thanks to the 100 bits. AJ the Traveler thanks to the 17 months. Okay. Then we get Tackle, Tail Whip, Bubble, and Withdraw. Wow, we get a full set of moves. And right, we don't have any ribbons. Um, yeah. And I rap on the beat. Bars! <laughs> I'm so cringe. Chat, I apologize for existing. Uh, Teal was excited to see the running shoes I got them. They ran out of here while saying something about holding Z, whatever that means. Uh, oh, it's a sink of water. The sink is full of water, which is normal for a sink. <laughs> Thanks, Cave. Uh, oh, it's a Wii. A Nintendo Wii. Now is not the time to play. And look, it's a bed. A laptop with a smudge screen. Wow, everything has smudge screens. Hey, be careful of smudging things. You might hurt you. You might cut yourself. <laughs> Books, toys, clothes, and games line the shelves. Cool. I'm also full of water. Am I a sink? Are we all sinks? Is everyone a sink? Uh, what's down here? Hayfield Path. Sorry about all this. Sometimes a Marine can be a little stubborn. I'm sure you come back later, so I'll be taken care of. All right. Interesting. <laughs> I hope you guys like the Pokemon fan games. Uh, I have a soft spot for all of them. Especially, like, when we begin. Um, the fan games. Um, it's just, like, a lot of fun. Because, like, I don't know, we get to experience them, like, like kind of together. And, like, kind of, like, kind of make fun of the stories, too, while also taking them, like, way too seriously. Um, and all that. I'll give you a little, um, uh, before we continue and, like, go on to everything else, right? Um, I, I get a lot of comments saying, uh, to play Pokemon Rejuvenation or Pokemon Reborn. Um, I'll state... That I only play fan games, or I'll only, like, cover fan games for Twitch and YouTube if they're finished. Uh, and so Reborn is, also, is is close to being finished. I know that. They're both, like, right there. They're just, like, finishing the final touches. So we will do those, but I like when they're finished. So then we can get, like, the whole story, you know. Because uh, right now I think, like, we can finish Reborn, but then, like, we skip, like, a gym or something. Uh, all that stuff, you know. But yeah, all right. Um, do you start right now? Yeah, the story so far, really easily. Um, we woke up on an island. No memory of how we got there. Nobody else knows. And now we're just trying to travel the region, figuring out how we got here in the middle of nowhere. I've already so I've also already played Xenoverse. It's just not edited yet. Hey there, hello. hey there, fellow adventurer. Looks like you're headed out on an adventure around Ego. Here's a couple traveling tips for you. The region of Ego profounds ego. Oh. <laughs> oh, whoopsies. It's ego, not ego. Um. But it like looks like ego though. I'm gonna just keep saying ego because it's like, you know, the waffle. <laughs> so we're gonna keep it as ego. <laughs> you're you're just incorrect, adventurer. It's small but dense. The people in Pokemon in each area can change based on the time and weather. Another tip, don't be afraid to go through people's homes to learn information from them and their belongings. <laughs> wow, imagine you saying that to like your... Hey, don't forget to go through your streamer's belongings to know more about them. People of Ego have experience with the Pokemon around here and they may have advice on raising them. Good luck. Uh, Chicken Runner, thanks for the seven months. Uh, Helios. Oh, Helos. 
Thanks for the $5 donation. Spit is just human tap water. Thank you for your insight. Mods you can ban. <laughs> Moonstone Path. I love the I love the soundtrack here. Is it loud enough? Spit is LA tap water. That's also true. Can't be a bit louder. Okay. Reborn and rejuvenation are hard type fan games. If you don't, if they're if they're not strategically good, you're going to suffer. Yeah, but I'll still cover them. Is that good? All right, let's run into some Pokemon. Nice. Wild Pidgey appeared. Um. All right, go Cumulus. Use Bubble. Nice. I like the UI here. It's really fast. And it crit me. Nice. Oh, it has an orange berry. Uh, an orange berry. Okay. It's like nice battle UI. I'm kind of down with it. We might literally die to a level three. Thank God we lived. <laughs> imagine, imagine there's a world in which we did it. Hello. Hey, here's a tip. Wild Pokemon are lurking in tall grass. If you see one walking around inside the grass, be careful. Those ones are usually stronger. Oh. So you can see Pokemon outside the grass. I hear that a roaming Pokemon even has a higher chance than normal encounters to have a, its hidden ability. Oh, that's kind of cool. So we might see like Pokemon outside of the grass. Love the new icon, thanks. Um, I'm really digging my new, um, I'm really digging my new uh, um, uh, profile picture. So I'm glad you like it too. Hey, level six, let's go. Uh, Cumulus is trying to learn Nimbus Fist. Uh, yeah. What is Nimbus Fist? Uh, 35 power, 100% accuracy. A strike of condensed mist strikes the foe, lowering its accuracy. That's so sick. Uh, we'll do it instead of, uh, withdraw, I think. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's like a water mud slap. That's pretty decent. I'll take it. That's kind of solid. Um, hey, you always know to check the, the 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 rocks. Oh, he's such a good Pokemon player. This obstacle looks like it could be cut down. Okay, that's a bike. The new profile picture looks real nice. I know, right? It's so cool. Um, like independently, it was actually really cool. Um. Uh, like Ross DM'd me, like Robert Ross DM'd me, and he's like, "Hey, I really like the new profile picture." And I was like, "What? Thanks, man. Appreciate that." And then I was at uh, um, dinner with a uh, uh, um, couple friends, and um, like Jada Animations was there, um, and like she also like independently was like, "Yo, like the art and the artist that you like you commissioned, fucking mint, dude." And I was like, "Yo," I was like, "Yo, that's so sick." She's so nice. Uh, okay. So we go here. I found a Pokeball. Just on the ground. Okay. That's just, that's just littering. Three orange berries. Okay. So we got another, oh, two right here. I can't speed up the game either, but I don't think I want to right now. Um, okay. So there's a Starly. Oh, right. So this is one of the roaming Pokemon. So it has like a higher chance of having a hidden ability. Do we catch the Starly? I know there's like, okay. So I know there's um new Pokemon, Nimbus Fist. That's cool. Um, I know there's like new Pokemon in this. Like there's Fakemon. There's 90 new Fakemon, if I recall. Let me, let me double check on that. Um, 90 plus Fakemon. Uh, first through sixth gen Pokemon and mechanics. Dynamic weather system. Unreal time system, um, which means the world runs on its own time. Um, extensive post game content. Level cap has been raised to 150. Trade evolution Pokemon are available via other methods and over 550 plus battle animations. Uh, 
Um, also, it looks like there's only five members of the council, so I'm really curious how... I don't know how long this game is. This hat makes me look cool. All right, chat, let's judge his hat. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the Council of Fashion. Does Youngster Paxton indeed have a badass hat? Put a one in chat if it's a good hat. Put a two in chat if the hat is trash. Wow, that is universally basically twos. I'm sorry, Youngster Paxton, but a couple thousand people that think your hat is not cool. <laughs> Sorry about that, my guy. Yeah, that's, I should have tackled. Uh, actions he felt? Maybe you miss your fairy wins? No, we die here. Let's go! After the unfortunate defeat, you will return to a safe place. Uh, so... I just didn't want to walk back to heal. Uh, dude, imagine if this was a Nuzlocke. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Oh, dude, uh, speaking of Nuzlocks, chat, thanks for being around for that Nuzlocke that we did a while ago. Uh, or like last week. We finished it last week. That was beautiful content. It brought us the man, the myth, the legend. Well, sorry. not The, the item, the myth, the legend. Sink. Uh, Pecro Sink. Um, and I think we'll keep that as a follower emote. So if you follow my stream, you can get the sync emote. It's just beautiful. Kaiser, thanks for the prime gaming. Thank you. And Hunkledorf, thanks for the 1,000 bits. First stream of yours I've been to. Been a fan since you played Twilight Princess. I know that's not a long time. That is a long time. That's like a year and a half ago. <laughs> I've only been streaming for like a year. I'm oh, sorry, for only like three years, so... That's a long time. <laughs> uh, but I'm glad I can finally make it to a stream. Hope you're doing well and good to see you. Hey, thanks for stopping by. I appreciate that. Thanks for the 1,000 bits. Thanks for being a long time viewer. Uh, Chad, I haven't been... Like, I'm a... In, in all things... Uh, all things considered, I am a... Um, I am a new streamer. <laughs> um, I have, like, no staying. Like, I've talked to, like, Ross, right? You know? Uh, I've talked to Rubber Ross, and he's older, um, and he's been on the internet since, like, the heydays, you know? <laughs> Back in the day, uh, and it's so weird to be, like, to talk to him about it, because he has all this insight from, like, early YouTube. Like, he'd be like, oh, yeah, MCNs, I remember those, you know? With, like, uh, was it Maker Studios and Machinima, and he was telling me all this stuff about, like, the Machinima contracts and stuff, you know? And I was like, dude, this is actually nuts. Uh, yeah, we're like pretty good friends. The, the, the guy is so nice. Uh, he's awesome. But anyways, it's literally like so weird because I'm like, yeah, I started YouTube like in the end of 2019. <laughs> like I haven't, I haven't been on YouTube for three years yet. I've been on YouTube for two and a half. I've been on Twitch for three years, but YouTube for two and a half years. And we have a million subs. Isn't that fucking nuts, guys? Isn't that crazy? You guys are so you guys are so cool. <laughs> I don't know, you know? Uh alright, we got another Pokeball. So thank you guys. I know it's it's actually bananas. It's nuts. Oh wait, I uh, went the wrong way. Minus 700k? No, on YouTube I have a million. Uh, but on Twitch, we have 800... Sorry. On Twitch, we have 383k. So about a third of that. Or about a fourth. All right, I want to see... I want to get this thing. What do you guys think of the art style of this, too? I am in love with this. This is, uh, like, amazing pixel art, in my opinion. It's, like, very clean, very polished. Hello, are you a trainer? Hi, I like shorts. They're comfy and easy to wear. Well, guess what? I'm wearing pants. I am your ultimate enemy. Any pants gang in chat? Uh, all right, Nimbus Fist. Dude, fuck shorts. 
I like shorts better than I like pants, though, so. <laughs> I'm just wearing pants because they're the only clean clothes I have. Um, so, I need to do laundry, chat. I'm at the bottom of the barrel right now, I'll be real with you. You know, like, when you're, like, digging in your closet, and you're like, I guess, I mean, this works together. Like, this is, like, a, a an okay fit. But then you're, like, concerned for tomorrow, because you're like, I don't really have anything tomorrow. Maybe I could wear that one thing that I wore three years ago and see if we can make it work. Oh, I lost. That's right, youngster Grady. Oh, I can't go down there. Uh, a person dude, thanks for the, uh, the eight months. Uh, Flanatol, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Uh, and Dennis, thanks for the 15 months. Speaking of subs, did you know you can subscribe for free with Prime Gaming? That, By the way, that was the sub message. That was not me plugging prime but like while we're at it anyways if you if you want to subscribe for free you know like why well, i mean like you know i you know i while we're on the topic right uh if you just if you want to subscribe for free get ad free viewing on twitch right ad free viewing um you can get emotes ad free viewing and a badge by your name uh for absolutely free free shirt no it's literally free like if you connect your amazon prime to your twitch prime account or to your twitch account you get a free subscription now you might be asking oh but point crow doesn't amazon prime also cost money not if you're a student you can get amazon prime for six months for free and still get a prime for free there is no need to spend any money for primes at all whatsoever which is why i plug it so much um because i'm just trying to get you guys some free value um literally but tuition okay yes okay if you're <laughs> all right i'm sorry jesus if you're if you're already happen to be in college <laughs> it's free with like a hundred thousand dollars of debt anyways you might as well milk the your your uh, you know your college email jesus christ oh my god regardless all you need to press is subscribe scroll all the way down click the subscribe free with prime and then use it. You don't have to use it on me. You can, you should use it on somebody. You can use it on Linkus. You could use it on CJ. Uh, I think Atriox live now. Um, I just employ you use it. This is a manual. Like I'm reminding you because you also have to manually renew it. It's not auto renews. Uh, hence why I remind you guys every day because mine is on the 22nd. Uh, my Prime Day is on the 22nd. So make sure you use your Prime. Boof. Thanks for the Prime Gaming powers. Richard. Thanks for the Prime Gaming. Max Stadded. Thanks for the Prime Gaming. Uh, Silent Wolf, thanks for the Prime as well. Appreciate it, guys. Uh, all right, let's continue on this route. Uh, there we go. Uh, oh, and then can we go over this way? Ooh, a little secret, I think. But yeah, thanks, guys, for the Primes. Appreciate it. Um, also, one Prime goes to the sub -roll. Um, You see this here? Water, crystal clear, pristine, immaculate. This is the best kind of water you can fish from. You see the bottom of the pond? You know it's Prime Fishing Area. Here, kid, uh, you can even give it a whirl with this old fishing rod. Ah, uh, yes, it always pays to, to go other ways. Uh, Luckiest, thanks for the Prime Gaming for two months. Appreciate it. Emmy Anemone, thanks for the 16 months of Prime. You want me to use my Prime of not being on Twitch for months. That's why I say it. Thanks for, uh, that's, I wish, I missed my Prime day because no one fucking plugs Prime. <laughs> Literally. It happens all the time. Uh, it was Alex, thanks for the Prime Gaming as well. Uh, Merchant's Ridge. I like how all of these are named not just like Route 1, Route 2. It's really cool how they're all named like something special. Nice. Youngster Joe. Hey, chat. Who's Joe? Oh, Joe Sniffy. Okay, that makes sense. Like the streamer, I was hanging out with him the other day, and uh, <laughs> dude, dude, he gets that literally all of the time. Like actually, like uh, I'd be like, yeah, I was talking about my friend Joe, and they're like Joe Mama. I was like, no, like Joe Sniffy, you know, like the my friend who happens to be named Joe, and he ha like he has a friend, and, and, and I have a friend too named Deanna. Like, Deanna Gowland's, like, the singer. And 
we call her D. Which, as you can imagine... Yeah, so we have... I, I have my two friends, Joe and D. It's a hard... I feel like they live hard lives right now. Now, it would be hilarious if there was another one named Candace. Oh my god, I'd have a field day. So this is hold back, a new move. The user holds back when it attacks, and the target is left with at least one HP. Oh, yo! This is a false swipe, basically. Um, Do we learn hold back, chat? I think we learn to hold back instead of... Tail whip. Or tackle. Which one? No, probably tail whip. Because tackle we use for, like, grass type stuff. Yeah. It's like an early false swipe. That's actually really nice. We did a battle. I'm so proud. Of, I'm so proud of you, youngster Joe. Um. Uh, ooh, what's this over here? You found a blue apricorn. Is it apricorn or apricorn? Shake the tree. Yes. Oh, it's a wormhole, dude. I love the sprites in this too. It looks so good. Is it apricorn or apricorn? I I never I never know. Okay, so you can keep shaking and get Pokemon. Okay. Oh, it's a it's a Weedle. Brittany, thanks for the 23 months. So it's apricorn. Okay. Um, oh, also, wait, wait, chat, 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 sorry, sorry. I know I keep getting distracted, but can I show you the funniest clip that I saw the other day? Um, I, ha I have to show this to you. Um, I was in, uh, do you guys know Maya, like Maya Higa? Uh, the streamer who was a co-host for the Stream Rewards and also does the LVA Sanctuary stuff? Yeah? Okay. So I was in her chat, right, and every now and then... Um, yeah, every now and then, basically, oh, shit, I fucked up. Um, she'll do a stream from her, uh, animal sanctuary. God, I hate the, ah, Twitch, you suck. Right, okay. Um, okay. Uh, and this is the funniest thing. I, I was a part of her chat. You can see me right here, right? And this was one of the funniest things I've seen in a Twitch chat in, like, a long while. Uh, I know, that includes you guys. And you guys are fucking hilarious. Which, like, shocked me. Right? So, the stream goes down, right? Uh, it, it, she's, like, an IRL stream. The stream goes down. So, her entire chat does veg. Right? They, like, all go to sleep. They're, like, like, um... They're, like, uh... You know, like, night-night and, like, sweet dreams, you know? A good stream, like it's like so cute, and it's really funny because here I'll, I'll do this. You can kind of hear it a little, a little bit. Cause it's like it's like nice music. It's like and oh, it comes back, <laughs> and it instantly. One minute. One minute. It's like wokage, and it's like what the fuck. <laughs> it's just like they just fall asleep and then they're like shocked awake by the stream again and i was like wait this is literally like i was like i don't dude i don't think youtube chat could 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 do something like that you know i just thought it was really funny anyways i don't know if you guys find it funny but i thought that was hilarious uh this guy for thanks for the prime gaming Anyways, yeah, I just want to show you that. How welcome? How can I serve you? Uh, we can buy a heavy ball, quick ball, nest ball. Wow, this early on. Um, I'll buy one quick ball. Um, and we'll save for a bit. Yeah, the coordination, dude. That's like a peak Twitch chat, which you guys have a lot, you know. Um, but I will say that. Uh, grill, wait up. What's up, Lucy? I'm glad I caught up to you. 
professor wanted me to meet up with you and give you this piece of junk. It's an old broken gadget he was hoping Thorn could fix. He thinks you could get use out of it. An old gadget. Okay. By the way, if you catch too many Pokemon, they'll automatically be stored in Thorn's PC. Yeah, the person you're on your way to meet also made Ego's PC service, allowing trainers to all over region to store their Pokemon with ease. Well, I'm going to head back to the lab. Keep going east, you'll, heat, you'll hit Sea Ridge Town. A little farther, and you'll reach Professor Thorn's lab. Good luck, Grill. There you go. I went and healed your Pokemon, too. Thanks, Lucy. Pupboy Man, thanks for the Tier 2 for 14 months. Thank you. That's crazy. That's over a year. Literally nuts. Uh, awakening. Nice. Do you have a town map? I do. I should have uh, should have uh, showed you guys. Uh, let's take a look at the town map. Whoa, it's small. Yeah, it's because it's, it's a little island here. I'm excited. Uh, yeah. Uh, apparently, it's like really it's small but really dense. Um, so we started in Haydust Town. Uh, and then we're up here, and we're going to Sea Ridge Town. There's a whole bunch of other stuff over here. Genesis Forest is where we woke up in. Um, that's why I say to my girlfriend, too, it's small but dense. Um, no, chat. I mean, this is like, this is like average size. This is like an average. This is, it's like an, it's like an average size map, you know? Diamond Peak Town. Interesting. No Zelda, I'm out of here. Here, you can be out of here for... Oh, my mods got for you. Damn it. I'm going to ban you. <laughs> my mods got to you first. <laughs> Shit. A little rude, dude. <laughs> yeah, it's not the size of the region, right? It's, how, how, it's like how you use the region, you know? Uh, we found TM01 Hone Claws. Okay. Whoa! We saw it become sunset over... That's so cool. My Pokemon love the ocean view. All right, that was pretty sick. Spec Gill links with 200 bits. Uh, Nimbus Fist. Um, also, I'll talk about it just a little bit, real quick. Um, whenever people say, like, ah, it's not Zelda, I'm leaving, or, like, when are you playing Zelda next? I just want to watch the Zelda stuff. It, I just, FYI, it makes me want to play Zelda less. <laughs> if, if I'm not doing what you want to see on on stream, that's cool. Come back later. <laughs> uh, that's it, right? That's all. This is FYI. Um, I'm not, like, mad or anything. I just want to explain my reasoning behind, like, the, the whole thing, you know? Uh, wow, yeah, the backgrounds are pretty in this. Um, but, yeah, just, just to explain where I'm like at with it just because I see it like every day so uh it's like it's gotten to the point too where it's like I just can't, like it doesn't seem like I can't like appease everybody so I'm just gonna do what I want to do you know <laughs> like you know uh but yeah anyways uh, I'm, I'm okay uh don't worry mods okay awesome nice we're, dude we're level nine already and we, dude, we're learning Aqua. Dude, how many fucking moves do we learn? Um, I'm, I, oh. Shit, do I learn Aqua Ring? That's actually, like, kind of good. Do I forget Bubble? Uh, you know what? Maybe I just delete Aqua Ring. Not, trade for Bubble? All right, I'll trade for Bubble. Fine. Sorry, I was distracted by the ocean view. Uh, let me also check my Pokemon stats here. So, Cumulus is a... Honestly, it's... It can go either way. Special attack or, or regular attack. We seem to be fine. Burner, 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 burn, burn. Fluffy Chocobot, thanks for the eight months. Ooh, ooh, gummies. Thank you so much for the 15. Eight months by a loft snow streak. Ah, it doesn't matter. Benjaminos, thanks for the six months in advance. Jesus, thanks for that trust. <laughs> After I picked up my Eevee from the daycare in Hayesport, I wanted to treat her to her favorite snack, a Michael Berry. Michael! 
<laughs> I didn't have any Michael Berries, so we came all the way up here, and the merchants didn't have any either. I feel like I let her down. Oh. Oh, no. That's so sad. Uh, that's actually so sad. What the fuck? Afro Buff, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Uh, we can talk to you. Welcome. How may I serve you? Uh, Pearl Nut. We can get an Ultra Ball? This early? A full restore and max revive? What the fuck? The merchants up here sell some pretty nice stuff, but they're all the way over. They're all way over my budget. Oh, that's why. Tricks D, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Thank you so much for that. I appreciate it. I mean, they, yeah, it is a small island, yeah. Wow, okay. Level 5 Meowth. I don't know if I want to catch this Meowth, though. We're also slow. Like, we're going second all of the time. That sucks. Catch the cat. Alright, I'll catch it. Um, okay. Uh, I'll use a regular Pokeball, because we're already two turns in for the Quick Ball. Turtle slow. Oh, that does make sense. It's a literal, it's like a turtle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. I'll take it. All right. What do we name the Meowth? Dog the Meowth. <laughs> Thanks, chat. Thank you. Ooh, Sea Ridge Town. Grandma, look! A Swablu. Where? I saw it fly by. Yeah, that's what birds do. Let's head inside. We wouldn't want to take a tumble down the cliff. I want to find it. Interesting. We're in Sea Ridge Town right now. Second town. Uh, and we're looking... Home of the Name Raider. That's funny. We're looking for... Um, specifically... Um, Thorn. Professor Thorn. Who might have answers to where, like, why we're on this island. I saw a bird fly into a tree, but my grandma won't let me check it out because it might be deceased. Oh. Yeah. How can I connect with my grandson? Our generations are so far apart, we've experienced two different kinds of upbringing. A pile of books that are probably full of words. <laughs> it's hard to keep your grandchildren entertained when you come from two totally different generations. Hey, look, it's a sink chat. The sink scattered with beads of water. Dishes must have been just been finished. It was an odd, oddly th like these sinks are oddly detailed, like with unique dialogue. <laughs> A sleek fridge. It's stocked full of delicious food. All right, so we gotta check out the deceased Swablu. Oh, I. I guess not. Okay. So the swa we can't check out the Swablu because it's most likely dead. All right. Yep. That. Okay. So we walk into Sea Bridge Town and they're like, Grandma, I saw a Swablu die. And she's like, don't check it out. It might be dead. Uh, and then we go check it and it's dead. So, yeah. You know, Pokemon that evolve via evolution stones have more malleable DNA. For example, what if you gave a different evolution stone to Pikachu? Okay, chat, remember that. Nice heal. Remember that, chat, please. Something in here? Is this the Swablu? Chat, is that the Swablu? <laughs> Oh my god, it's the Swablu. Oh my god, it's the Swablu. It's not dead. What is... What is that?
All right. It's ice type. Do I want this? All right, that's probably a one HP. Let me catch it. Yeah, a full cloud team. That'd be kind of sick, wouldn't it? Let's go! Swablu it is! Yeah, I'll become the cloud gym leader. It's normal ice type. Okay, the snow cloud Pokemon. Um, Swablu tuck themselves into the cottony feathers they have to keep warm during blizzards. Blocks hum in unison as they're bundled up. Yeah, well, what do we call it? What do we name it? Nimbus? Alright, Nimbus it uh it, no, probably Cloud or Nimbus. It's fucking deceased. Are, okay, hey. Oh, I spelled it wrong! <laughs> Nimbusy. <laughs> yeah, good thing. Yeah, chat. Good thing. Um. Uh, the home of the name raider is here. Are you the name raider? <laughs> now we have an excuse to find them. My husband is upstairs. He has been making up nicknames for decades. For some reason, he thinks it's his life calling. Apparently, it's uh, when you say you're the best at something, people will go along with it. Hey, guys, I'm the best streamer. Ever. Nodders, right? Yeah. Hello, hello. I'm the official name raider. Uh, you want me to rate the names of your Pokemon? Yes. Can you critique Nimbus? <laughs> That's a decent nickname. Would you like to give it a nicer name? Yes. <laughs> From now on, this Pokemon shall be known as Nimbus. It's a better name than before. How fortunate for you. The best for... Wait, sorry. The best names. List one. Read. Darius, Scully, Richter, Marcorcio, Rivet, Ezekiel, Rivendale, Block, Fisher, Masher, Smasher, Dixon, Twisty, Spitzy, Raptor, Pixie, Flathead, Bulbo, Randy, Mitten, Scorch, 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 Porch, Ladle, Phineas, Tido, Grimy, Mimey, Maggie, Shaggy, Tootsie, Baggy, Reptar, Rolfo, Zippy, Dallas. Bars! Wait, are they all filled with these? Wifflebat, Spike Bob, Trash King, Slurry, Floorplot, Flimtrot, Glory, Grady, Flixy, Fairy, Faily, uh, Rivio, Riviere, Oroverl, Oroverl, Floor River, Drawbringer, Grandelier. Bars. I have no idea. New Pokey Rap. Show about trainers who take on the Ego uh, Council Challenge. I just had a stroke. All right, let's heal our Pokemon up. Cool Pokemon Center. Oh, hello there. My name is Donnie. I'm an avid shiny hunter, and I'm not ashamed to admit it. <laughs> At least the game is self-aware. <laughs> A shiny is what we call Pokemon that have rare colorings, different from what they usually have. They say you'll run into a shiny Pokemon once every 5,400 encounters on average. Okay. Anyway, I'm off to continue the hunt. Maybe I'll see you around, Grill. Great to meet you, Grill. See ya. Huh, I wonder who that is. Uh, welcome to Seabridge Pokemon Town Center. Thank you for waiting. We restored your Pokemon to full health. Awesome. How does he know? Yeah, wait. How did he know my name? Weird. Uh, doesn't my Jigglypuff have a lovely singing voice? It's awesome that you can get your Pokemon healed for free. In some uncivilized places, you have to pay to be taken care of. In other words, if you didn't have enough money, you could just be left to die. How sad. Yeah, that's crazy. Man, that would be... That would fucking suck. If you didn't, like, you know... Have free healthcare. Universal free healthcare. That would be wild, where if you didn't have enough money to pay, you could just die? 
That's crazy. Fucking hell, dude. Uh, who would you like to call? Oh, Wormwood. It's like a phone. Hello? Uh, oh, we can just chat. Looks like you figured out how to use telecom units. Very nice. The natural sense of curiosity. You'll figure out where you can, uh, where you came from in no time. And he just hung up on me. Okay. All right. Um. All right. Here we go. Does the streamer literally getting paid on capitalist morals? <laughs> just because, just because I'm a part of the system doesn't mean I can't hate it. <laughs> All right, we'll go over here. Uh, a lot of people came, uh, come to this town to have their nicknames critiqued by the name raider. I don't get why anyone cares what he thinks. It's not like coming up with names is hard. Watch this. Lars, Gerald, Bixen, Karen. See how easy that is? What's up, Meowth? Cute. Women Sheep, thanks for the uh, 16 months. Time to chill with some good old Pokemon and cozy blanket. My sister has always had a gift of communicating with Pokemon. As for me, I kind of just exist, serving no observable purpose. Same though. <laughs> Shit. Wow, this game, this game's real. <laughs> this is a self-aware NPC. There's something great about cheese. You can put it on anything. It tastes good on tacos, noodles, bread, pizza, salad, bagels, biscuits, potatoes, broccoli, burgers, eggs, more cheese, and even cake sometimes. I guess cheesecake, yeah. Looks like this faucet has, been a, uh, has a bit of a leak. Uh-oh. Oh, uh, Frogger Mini, thanks for the five months of Prime. Appreciate that. Look, another... Dude, it's another thing. Uh, it's the Name Raider house. Painting a Voltorb, concealed in a thicket. Uh, our daughter seemed to have a connection with Pokemon. She's very good at sensing all their overall affection towards the trainer. Oh, hello. I knew you'd come. You're here for me to read the bond between you and your Pokemon, right? Sure. Uh, what about Cumulus? Your Cumulus is a little friendly to you. That's what I'm getting. Okay. A large stuffed Snorlax doll. I, I like the dolls. It's a real Raichu, but it's holding perfectly still. Soft plush far fetched doll. It's a fake Pikachu, just a doll. Stop Gengar doll. Green and eccentric. <laughs> okay. Real. This is cool. Oh, it's like nighttime now. I like the day uh, day night cycle. It's kind of cool. It probably it probably occurs over the course of an hour. I'm assuming. More berries. More berries. The girl that talks to Pokemon and advertise the name raider? Yeah, because everyone cares about the name raider. Chat, do you guys care about the names that I make my Pokemon? Say yes to your band. Yes, there you go. I should make a town named after me. What the fuck? Wait. Did you guys... Did you guys just see the woman disappear? Wh what? Okay. My brother Donnie left to continue his hunt for shiny Pokemon. He left behind this grumpy shelter that I don't really want. It's not even a shiny or anything. I'd rather, much rather prefer a Dunsparce. If you had Dunsparce, would you trade it? No, okay. Uh, yeah, any clip? Yeah, yeah, Disappearing Woman. Yeah, right there. Oh, look, look, look.
This is the woman. How often do we uh, do things out of pure nostalgia, hoping to relive the experiences from our past? But an experience can only truly happen once. You must enjoy them while they last. A miscolored Clefable doll. Cool. Um, why does all the dialogue go hard? It seems like they put a lot of care towards this uh, fan game, and uh, I think I rec I recognize it. Yo, okay, so it's nighttime, which is why like she changed and everything. Um, so there's now new people and places and dialogue in the night. Each day seems to pass faster than the one before. As soon as you sit down and appreciate the day you've given, the next one is already here. Yeah, like this is a purloin now. At night. And like you're sitting here. Or that kid that uh, the professor found in the woods. Kind of a weird place to be found, but you do you. <laughs> I didn't ask to be. I didn't ask to be found. You know, like there. You know, like it, it wasn't. Yeah, so this is really neat. You, you, there's like now different like places, dialogue, and people based on time. Hard to figure out what I can do with my obsession. Well, uh, with my, it's hard to figure out what I can do with my obscene wealth. Perhaps I'll try to pay for some influence with the mayor of Hayesport City. Relatable, obviously, you know. Sometimes I'm just like, gosh, I hate when I just have too much money, you know? God. Anyway, speaking of which, uh, don't forget to use your Twitch Prime if you have it available. Um, just in case, you know, if you haven't, you might, you might as well check to see if it is. <laughs> All right. Uh, do we talk to, the I think we talked to that guy, yeah. All right, here we go. Uh, chat, would you guys like a Picro Prime emote? Asking for a friend. Abraxas, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Thank you. For the Prime plugs. Yeah, we have like a we have a bunch of emote slots. Um. So I was considering making new emotes. So I'll commission them for you guys. Stone Dust Trail. Whoa! This is so cool. Does the Poochiana follow us? Oh! It's following me because it wants to, like... It wants to fight me. Oh, that's so cool. That's so neat. Wait, I really like that. Uh, Zero Frozen, thanks for the three months. Uh, all right, I will Nimbus Fist you. Fork. Fork. Uh, yeah, Zero Frozen, thanks for the three months. Thank you. Welcome back of your prime. I think we do, I think we should catch the Puchiana. It's level nine, you know. This is, it's what Professor Birch saw before disaster. Just the, the following Puchiana. What's the purpose for Pico Sync? If you know, you know. If you know, you know. Rest in peace. Um, okay, let me do this, Pokeball. Any any knowers in chat? Any lore Andes wanna fill them in? Hey, we're level 10. Oh, we got XP for catching Pokemon in this. Cool, okay. Alright, what do we name it? Oh, that's easy. That's the easy one. All right. Pewee! Some Pokemon evolve just by leveling up. Other Pokemon evolve when they're traded. Most Pokemon evolve through trading can actually evolve if they level up while holding a specific item as well. Awesome. So they've gotten they've gotten rid of trade evolutions in this. You know it's a good game then. You know. A white Apricorn. Cool. That's how you know it's a good game. Guess what I'm looking for. Would really dig a Cherok emote? Oh, yeah, if we reach 7,000 subs. I've said this for the past two years. <laughs> At 7,000 subs, which is a lot, I'll make a Picro Cherry emote. But we gotta reach this sub goal first. Um, no. 
Uh, we'll use tackle for this though, because you're you're bug type. We'll get there during the subathon. I don't know if we will. I'll be real, right? Because 30 seconds per sub is like ridiculous when you think about it. Like it's ridiculously low. We've literally planned like a week for the subathon. <laughs> I'll be real with you guys. I don't think it's gonna go longer than seven days. I don't. So I that's like a that's part of a challenge. I don't think I don't think you guys will be able to do it. Uh wow, you have four Pokemon, Jesus. Uh we'll level up Nimbus, I guess. Nigerian Prince, uh thanks for the five dollars. Uh how many channel points for someone to name your firstborn child? Um you know what? I'll just give my naming rights to my firstborn child to you guys, chat. Just just, to, just for existing. You know, just for being my Twitch chat. What should I name my, uh, my firstborn? <laughs> That's a bad idea? What do you mean? Why do you, why do you say bad idea? That sounds like a great idea. Sink, Grill, or Nimbus. Alright, god damn it, guys. Code locked. Thanks for the Prime Gaming. Thank you. And Tangerine Hello. Thanks for the Prime as well. And the follow right afterwards. Or right before. Just name it Come. <laughs> Imagine. These are my children. Um, Jonathan and Come. Uh, I named him after... Well, that's how he was born, you know? Uh, I know, I don't want to battle. I'm not in the mood for it. Oh, okay. Uh, three Koba berries. Sure. Uh, Chopple berries. All right, we'll take them. If they ask you, it's a foreign name. Yeah, it's actually German. Cool. Uh, okay. Sick. Hey, we found a tomato berry. All right, so what are all these? We have so many berries in our bag right now. I named him after his ingredients. Jesus fucking Christ, chat. Uh, all right, so tomato berry lowers base speed. Chopal, uh, super effective fighting type attack against the holding. Uh, okay. Flying type and rock type. Oh, that's kind of cool. Call your child failure? Why why don't why would I call them failure when I could just call, name them after you? Um all right, sick. I think we'll just I think we'll still nimbus fist against this guy. Oh hey chat! Uh, it's all in good fun. There's one person out there being like, wow, Point Crow really hates his viewers. Like, 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 there's, you know, there's one person, just, just one person in chat right now, just being like, damn, like after that one thing over there and this other thing, and then now this, Point Crow really hate, wow, he hates streaming. <laughs> oh, that's so funny though. Uh, return, that'll be big. Piper, thanks so much for the two months. Welcome back to the murder god in the stream. All right, so what's over here? Hey, Grill. Oh, what's going on? Um, Teal is your name. I forgot. You're so forgettable. Um, I was going to head down through Hayfield Path, but I thought I'd try to catch up to you for a quick battle. I'm a little out of breath, but let's go. Oh, Teal looks a lot more buff in his sprite work here than like his little like four like. Like, like, Teal looks kind of big, you know? <laughs> um. Yeah, he looks much older. All right, we'll just name his fist here. Uh, and then I'll Aqua Ring. Yeah, I thought he was a child as well. He's kind of a Chad. Oh, only two HP. Oh, that's kind of ass.
What is Nimbus Fist, by the way? It's like a physical bu like bubble. Okay. Um, and then we uh, restore. I think I will... Oh, he's going to send in Bulbasaur. So I'll send in Nimbus here. Who's going to be a ca our counter to his Cactus. Oh, oh my god, he's so cute. Oh, chat, I, uh, I'll be real. I, I might regret not choosing Bulbasaur. Come on, he's a cactus. All right, I'll use Powder Snow there. Yeah, that's probably good. He's so cute. What a Charmander look like? It was like a regular Charmander with a blue flame, you know. He's so cute. Okay. Damn, Nimbus. Damn. I wasn't prepared for that. Uh, defeat I can learn from. See you around, Grill. Bye, Teal. Um, okay. So this is... I'll switch here for Nimbus. Um... Yeah, this is Cumulus, which Cumulus is also really cute, too. Um, okay. Stone Dust Peak. Okay, cool. Um, oh, there's a Puchina. No, run, 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 run. <laughs> hey there, fellow adventurer. Looks like you're taking a journey across Ego. Here's a few tips for you. There's an Abra around here that likes to tease people. I wouldn't waste too much of your time trying to catch it. No one has been able to. Another thing, the majority of Pokemon you see roaming outside the grass will not let you escape from a battle. Dude, I'm literally getting camped right now. Yeah, like, bro. If you plan to take one on, you better be prepared. Fuck. So I can't run from this level 12 Puchiana? Oh, I can't. Okay, we're good. Ego? Website says ego for pronunciation. Yeah, but I started pronouncing it ego, and then honestly, um, I think it's just better. <laughs> My favorite path. Uh, it's a nice dress pack. Don't walk on it. Camper Dakota and Camper Jamie want a battle. Okay, so they, they don't have a high Pokemon. Okay, we're good. Um, so I'll use Nimbus Fist on the Pineco, and then I'll use Powder Snow. Uh, anyways, alright, so we're about, like, in a little over an hour into the game. What do you guys think so far? Uh, we haven't gotten much in the way of story. It's just, like, we're just woke up and we're trying to figure out where we came from. So not too much, but I'm curious. Keep streaming? No, I'll, I'll keep streaming. Like, I've only been streaming for uh, almost two hours. I, it's not too much. It's high quality. Yeah, yeah. I want to see some fake Emon, though. It's cool. Okay. It seems like it seems likable, at least. Um, it, I'll only make it a video uh, on YouTube if I like the story enough to make it a video, you know? Like, if it's something where I can, like, be like, oh, this is the Pokemon game that... Y where you murder 15 children, uh, then, like, I'll do that, you know? Um, I want to see some Fakemon in battle using two Fakemon. That's true. <laughs> well, I want to I see more, you know? I'm curious. That sounds like Insurgents. Yeah, and Insurgents was a great video, wasn't it, right? Can't wait for the thumbnail where there's a Pokemon getting brutally murdered. I don't have thumbnails of Pokemon getting brutally murdered. What do you mean? Uh, well, okay. And then, oh, yeah, uh, yeah, okay. Yeah. But, like, if you go farther back, there's not one of... Um, anyways, let's keep playing this other Pokemon fan game where you definitely don't get brutally murdered or brutally murder Pokemon. <laughs> I 
Doodle Dan, thanks for the three dollars. Cumulus and Nimbussy. That is all. Oh, I swear to God. Can can I refund your three dollars? Is that am I allowed to do that? Bob, thanks for the two years of a resub. Thank you. Two years went by quickly. I know it's insane. Uh, thank you so much for enjoying for that long. That's crazy. I've already done Uranium and Rocket Red. What ROM hack should I play next? Insurgents. Or, or Xenoverse. Or you could play along uh, Infinity while I'm playing it. Uh, is there anybody in chat actually playing along? I used to do that all the time when I when I watched um, Chugga Conroy. Um, when like he was playing like his Pokemon Emerald, uh, his Pokemon Emerald playthrough. What I would do is I would come back from um, uh, I would come back from school, and uh, I would uh, boot up my own Pokemon Emerald game, and then I would play along with him. Like I'd watch his video, and then I would play like my Pokemon Emerald game and then when he like stopped his video then I would stop right there um, and uh, yeah it was just kind of cool uh, I really liked it it was like a really it was a nerdy thing obviously um, but yeah I, it like I really enjoyed it <laughs> Pokemon Unbound uh, we played we started to play it once upon a time and then I stopped for some reason so we might replay it again uh, but yeah, would recommend it, you know. So if you guys want to do the same thing for Pokemon Infinity, that'd be awesome. Uh, if you want to play along. Uh, hello, are you a trainer? We're not. The obstacle over there can only be destroyed by a Pokemon. Humans are too weak. You haven't said that to me. Oh! I'm going to break the blood vessel. Fuck. <laughs> It's the Pokemon that are in control, not us. Our freedoms are just an illusion. They allow us to joy. Wait, I'm sorry. What the fuck? Humans are too weak. It's the Pokemon that are... <laughs> sorry. Humans are too weak. It's the Pokemon that are in control, not us. Our freedoms are just an illusion. They allow us to enjoy. Hey, man. Are you okay? Are you good? I guess no free will. Put a wide people happy in chat if you have no free will. I hiked up the stairs just a little bit ago. Congrats, man. Congrats. Yo, look at that Spearow, though. Damn. It's like, what, dark flying or something? That's pretty sick. All right, Nimbus seems to be able to take their own. Stop with the Fury attack, please. Thank you. Cussed up berry made it move first. So there's a lot of unique berries here. That's kind of cool. That's just not a phase mom. This is the real me. Uh, we'll stay in for Zubat. Oh, it's a regular Zubat. I regret staying in for Zubat. Never mind, I don't. Dude, look at those animations. Wait, this is really sick. The, the absorb animation was kind of nuts. Are you nuzlocking this? No, I don't, I don't really nuzlock things. Uh, they're not. Nuzlocks aren't really for me. I. When I play. Oh, we gotta catch it. Oh, we gotta catch it. Um, when I play fan games, um, I really like to dive into the story more than really care about keeping my Pokemon alive, you know? Uh, just personally, you know? Uh, I like to make it less challenging. Fuck you. Five times? All good, just curious? Yeah, no, no worries, no worries. Um, I, I just haven't answered a question like that before. Um, uh, just because, yeah, it's like if I did a fan game, I wouldn't do a challenge. 
It's like one or the other. Um, just because it's also like too much to like explain to an audience of like, oh, we're doing this fan game where we woke up on the middle of an island and we have no idea where we are and we need to find our memories. Also, by the way, we're doing a challenge where we only use level one Pokemon and if we get, you know, it's, it's just that whole like, you know, extra thing. Nice. We got a new Spearow. It's dark. It's dark fighting type. Wow. What do we name it? Fruity book. My Chemical Romance. I can't. Do I just. I can't name it MCR either because that's. It, it won't get it. You know. Um. Should I just be like Green Day? That worked. Dude, I dude, I'm being camped. I'm being camped. Oh my god. Um, can I run? Okay. I would like to run, please. Thank you. Hello. Maybe while I'm young, I can predict the mistakes I'll make in the future and then just not make those mistakes. Seems pretty easy. This game is... This game's dialogue is just so good. It's so funny, dude. Uh, I'll get this. Safeguard. Okay. And the art style does go, go hard. Um, I'm curious. Oh, I just found a palm egg berry on the ground. Cool. Um, oh, hello. The tree appears to be moving. Did we touch it? Zachary, thanks for the one year. Thank you. Only if it consents. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> hey, random tree that's moving. May I touch you? It's a Bonsley. Yeah. Okay. Um. All right. I would like I should probably catch this right maybe we're catching too many Pokemon what do you think should we catch it why Fortnite dude I, I feel like every like 12 year old spells Fortnite wrong I'll catch this one um <laughs> Okay, what we'll do here? It's actually incredible. <laughs> oh, P-H. Oh, God. What is this spelling? Oh, God. Fortnite. <laughs> hey, guys. Wow, let's go play Fortnite. <laughs> That's goddamn beautiful. That's what that is. Uh, we're level eight. Nice. Uh, trying to learn sing, dude. I'll, I'll learn sing. Uh, I don't. Sorry, I don't need to learn sing because I'm already a fantastic singer. You know. Where are you? And I'm so sorry. I cannot. <laughs> no. I'm uh, pretty good. All right. Wait. What's what's the touch? It, it just touched grass, right? Chat, what's the emo for touch grass? It's touch grass, okay. Yeah. 
Yo, is that a Shanks? Bro. This is like a secret area. And the Abra. Dude, we gotta catch the Abra. I, I don't care. We're catching the Abra. Apparently, we can't. But let me save here. Nice. How good is your fake laugh? I've never faked laugh on stream. <laughs> oh, what the hell? All right, so it left. Yeah, Wokej. How do you pronounce that? Wokej? Hey, Shanks. Doggy, thank you so much for the nine months. The cutie laugh that Ludwig stole. Oh, the, uh, I don't know how to, it's like, <laughs> or whatever, it's, <laughs> whatever that is. Oh, it's a Baneri. Sick. Um, nah, I, I, a lot of people say it sounds, it's, it's fake. It doesn't, it's not fake. It's like a real laugh. <laughs> uh, no, that's like a, that's a real laugh. I've actually like slowly, um, uh, I, I've, I've slowly, like, adopted it just by watching too much of cutie streams. Donuts and Oreos, thanks for the two months. I remember to use my Prime, and ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, that's why I remind you to use your Twitch Prime so you don't have to remember yourselves. No, 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 no. Uh, dude, we want to learn bite as well. Um, all right, we're gonna we're gonna learn bite over tackle because it's just a better tackle and it might flinch. Thank you for robbing me of my of my free will. I got you. You're legally not allowed to leave until I'm not on stream for 15 minutes. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's it's kind of like the contract. Like when you enter stream. Yeah, the bell doesn't excuse you. I do. <laughs> oh, God. It's like the college professor rule, can't leave class until 15 minutes late. Well, from what I've learned from college, you know, back in my day of college, um, it's not the, it's not like if the, it's just like, you don't, you just don't have to go to class if you don't want to. Um, it's not like a mandatory thing. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, keep in mind chat, I also got C's in college, so. Diabro. Oh, look, a trainer for me to battle. Okay. You can also just leave whenever you want. I don't, no one really takes attendance. Unless you're in like a, unless you're in like upper division sort of like, you know, like higher level classes. So he's got degrees. Yeah, I do have a degree. So, you know, that proves it. Um, unless, so he's got degrees, unless you're like in health or a lawyer. Uh, in which case, C's, uh, C's don't get degrees. Or C's get degrees, but don't get into law school or nursing school. Yeah. <laughs> or just a job. Templo, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Yo, it's a Buneary again? Let's go. Nice. Good to know my doctor didn't get C's. Oh, I mean, statistically, it's likely that your doctor did get C's. 
or like AC, you know? We're not all perfect. <laughs> I think getting Ds is more accurate. Oh, this is... That's for communication majors. Oh, I took a I took a couple communications classes um, to like to round out my degree. Um, I actually didn't do so hot in communications classes. My brain is not wired for for that kind of stuff. Uh, I feel like uh, as much as people will clown on any anything, um, I'll, like completely honest, um, each discipline has its own thing, you know. Uh, well, some are like you know. Okay, how do I put this? Um, at my university that I went to, it's really hard for engineers to graduate in four years because of how fucking compact they've made the schedule. You could major in communications three times over just to barely reach the amount of classes that you need to take for engineering. But it's different because communications has hard classes in itself. I ain't never heard of an engineer that graduated in four years. Yeah, I graduated in four years and I took an extra semester over summer. <laughs> Hello. Goodbye. We gotta find it again, I guess. I'm gonna let it heal up again. And you got a piece of paper for it? I did! And it's sitting in my bathroom right now. <laughs> it's, it's literally in my guest bathroom. <laughs> it's like, like, I put it there because it's like, just in case we run out of toilet paper, it's, it's there if you need it, you know? Because that's what it's being used for. Let's go. Someday someone's actually gonna use it. I mean, I did use it for uh, the, like the stream where we broke the world record and blew up a car. Uh, in case you don't know about it, it was this one right here. I broke the world record for the largest chemistry experiment. I actually used my degree for that. I had to do uh, way too many um, calculations of chemistry that yeah, I also got them wrong the first time, which is why we have literal gallons of Dawn soap in our our house right now. So, oh, uh, like I I overestimated how many Dawn like how much soap we needed for the reaction. So we have like a good extra forty liters of it. So, yeah. Um, anyways, we don't really, we have a lifetime supply of soap right now. We don't really need any more. So what you're saying is you could have went bigger? Well, we should, we could have. Um, but the company that gave us the, uh, hydrogen peroxide for the reaction, um, actually only fulfilled part of our order. So rather than having 2,000 liters of hydrogen peroxide, we end up only having, um, uh, 1,600. So rather than double the previous world record, we can only 1.6 times it, you know? We did 60% more, essentially. So in short, you have too much money. I'll be real with you guys, chat. I have a lot of money, but I'm spending it all on videos this year. That's what I'm doing. I, it's, I'm doing it all for entertainment this year. Like I'm literally, that's I, I've said this a couple times on stream, but the beginning of January, right? This is not flexing. I, I wouldn't say it's flexing. Flexing would be like I have more money than you, you fucking poor people. Uh, no, it's like what I'm trying to say is like I make a lot of money from YouTube and Twitch, and it's I'm specifically taking all of that this year, uh, everything I make, so all of your primes, donations, whatever, 
and I'm putting that right into content. Like, specifically, right? Um, I'm literally... That's bragging. Is that bragging, chat? I don't think it is. I could be wrong. I'm just trying to say that, like, I'm trying to make you guys really good content this year that you wouldn't see otherwise if it weren't for you guys watching my videos and giving me primes. Like, I'm trying to tell you how I'm, like, I'm, being, I'm trying to be transparent about how I'm using the stuff that you give me. Yeah. <laughs> just, just, I want to make sure, because I, there's, like, a fine line of, like, we've, I've had ideas for videos where it's like, dude, I want to do this video, it'd be so cool, but then we can't exactly, because it's, like, it, I'm, like, I can't spoil the idea because we might do it in a different way in the future. But, like, one of the ideas was, like, oh, we're doing all this really cool stuff. But, then it, like, it came across as, like, you know, the typical, like, oh, I'm a rich YouTuber in L.A. And I was, like, oh, I don't want to, I, I just want to do cool stuff. But not make it seem that, like, I'm flexing on my audience, you know? Anyways, that's what I'm doing this year. Um, I'm taking everything that you guys give me. And then I'm putting that towards videos. Um... There is a, I won't say exactly, but there's like a video at the end of the year um, that we've already started planning. It's like a quarter million dollars. I'm not going to make money back on it. I'm just doing it because it's fun and I want to see you guys enjoy it. Literally, they, like one of the reasons I want to do it is because I can't wait for, to see your reaction to it. Because it's fucking insane. Oh, look, solar panels. That's kind of cool. Uh, this is also, like, a weird, like, there's, like, weird puzzles, it looks like. Hey! What's up? You're finally here! Oh! Hey, it's Professor Thorn! Hey there, kid! The name is Professor Thorn! I talked to Wormwood a little bit ago. Uh, he said you may be in need of some assistance. Uh, well, lucky for you, I'm the smartest there is. Do you think it's your craziest idea yet? No! I'm actually... Sorry, l l sorry to talk over this again. It's not. So the, the the one I was talking about by the end of the year, it is not my craziest idea. Um I have a I have a bunch of crazier ideas. I just actually don't have the capital of, to do them. <laughs> I'm currently constrained by time and money, which I feel like most people are, but it's like I have some like ideas that would be like, "Ah, shit. That would cost a literal million dollars to produce." Maybe in, in another year, you know? <laughs> like Maybe one day I'll get to that. Um, so it's like kind of that style. Um, or like time where it's like, that would be so cool to do. I just literally don't have time. You know? <laughs> Point Crow buys the earth, the video. Great idea. <laughs> Zaya, thanks for the 100 bits. Um... I have extensive experience in astrophysics, uh, neurology, quantum mechanics, chemistry, astronomy, biology, sociology, computer programming, and I can keep going, but I'm sure you've zoned out by now. Uh, my point is that if anyone can help you figure out your mysterious origins, it's going to be me. Judging by what Wormwood told me, it sounds like you have no previous memories since you, before you arrived on Ego. It's good that you remember your name, but not entirely impressive. I think it's impressive that I remember my name. I get points on tests if I write it down. I have a few working theories, but I need more information before I can start ruling anything out. So the first thing we have to do is run a diagnosis scan of your brain and other vitals. From there, I can start to get to the bottom of this. You'll have to do it right this second. Feel free to rest in my place for a bit. When you're ready to run a preliminary scan, meet me down in my lab. By the way, I hope you've been utilizing the Pokemon storage system I created. If your team fills up, extra Pokemon you catch will automatically be transferred there. You're welcome. Thanks, Professor Thorn. You're a real one. Cool. Uh, three lumberries. I, I also, like, apparently, it looks like the Abra thing is, like, a little kind of puzzle that we can do. And I'm kind of, I kind of want to do it more, you know? Did I miss a Pokemon gen? What's that? This is a fan game. Uh, every now and then I do fan games. Uh, if you want to check out the other ones, they're on YouTube. Um, and, uh, yeah. Kind of like that. Jupiter, thanks for the six months. Thank you. Uh, but yeah, this is this Pokemon fan game. It's called Pokemon Infinity. We woke up in the middle of nowhere uh, in the forest. Uh, and yeah, uh, we just, we woke up in the middle of nowhere in the forest and we're just kind of 
trying to figure out why the hell we're on this island's region. And and what happened to us? You can see uh, the town map right here, right? We're just we woke up right over here and we're wondering where the hell, like why we're here. Lancer, thanks for the five gifted subs. Thank you. All right, uh, chat. Do we run a diagnostic scan? Show the party. Yeah, I'll show the party. I'll try to keep you guys updated every now and then. Um, like every like hour or so, I'll go over like the general plot and like the Pokemon we have, just because I know it's like I want to make sure that you guys are into it. Like you guys know what's happening. You know, so I think it's a good idea. Like, hear, hear me out on this. All right, so every hour of streaming, I'll just like quickly re-explain the plot and like the Pokemon, just so you guys like have an idea of what's going on. Is that is, good idea? Anyways, we have Cumulus, we have Nimbus, who is a Ice Normal Swablu. We have Dog, uh, some random egg uh, that we were given, Cat, and Fallout Boy, the Dark Fighting Spearow. Right. So uh, basically, uh, we were we found we were found uh, by Professor Wormwood. He took us in. He's like, "Yo, hey, nobody knows who you are. How'd you get here?" We're like, "We lost our memory. I have no idea." And he's like, "Hey, my friend Professor Thorne could help out." And now we're at Professor Thorne's house, and she's gonna help us out. Uh, it's a field guide for Stone Dust Peak. Yeah. Which encounters would you like to look at? Oh, oh, you can see like grass encounters. You may encounter a wild Pokemon moving through the grass. Uh, Pat Rat, Nidoran, Spearow. Oh, so it tells you all of... Yeah. It tells you everything that you can uh, see. Okay, that's kind of cool. Uh, a few sheets of incomprehensible notes. Nice. Hey, look. A sink. A few food crumbs lay near the drain. Modern food cooling unit. Very sleek. Probably illegal to dig through people's garbage. Oh. Okay. <laughs> and then a bed. Would you like to rest? <gasps> Let's let's sleep, and we can choose how many hours to sleep. That's actually really cool. Just to make it like daytime or nighttime. Let's do like six. Good night, chat. Good night. <laughs> That's so neat. And then a Wokage. <laughs> wait. I actually have a better idea. Chat, wait, wait, wait. Because we already have Picro Z, right? Would you guys like a Picro Z and then a Picro, like, Woke? But, like, in the style of Beg? Yeah? Okay, okay, okay. Let me write that down. All right, wrote it down. We're good. All right, sick. Um. Oh, let's go downstairs, I guess. Uh, you're no. That's what's upstairs then. Diagnostics is downstairs. Is it true that you have more cake than Ludwig? That is very true. Yes. Uh, Flash. He'll say no. Uh, but, you know. Powerful light. Once turned on, ships can see it from the ocean miles away. He'll say no, but I did win the ass off at the streamer awards. So, yes. It is I, Point Crow. The man who has a bigger ass than Ludwig himself. Sean, thanks for the seven months. Um, sick. Two books, one's called Simulated Realities, and the other is called uh, Why None of This Matters. What's that one meme where it's like what they don't, like the two books that contain all knowledge in the universe, what they teach you at Harvard, and what they don't teach you at Harvard? <laughs> These papers seem to detail the ideas for some sort of exploration suit. Cool. Uh, folder with what looks like to be notes about interdimensional travel. What the fuck? The control panel for the computer system. It looks more advanced than any computer you've used before. That's cool. Series of wires and knobs. Some lab equipment sits on the shelf. Machine is vibrating softly, warm to the touch.
Um, there you are. I hope you were able to find your way around the place okay. Yeah, it's a server. It's like, you know, like words up, you know, like with hard drives. There you are. I hope you were able to find your way around the place okay. Before I forget, didn't Wormwood send some sort of device with you that he wanted me to fix? Right, the old gadget. Right, I forgot about that. Oh, perfect. I'll take a look at this once we're done. Fairly good at engineering tasks, so I should be able to do something with this. Speaking of, do you see this machine in front of us? It's a device of my own creation. An advanced quantum particle displacer. Basically, it allows me to run a deep scan of an object and then manipulate individual molecules of the scanned subject. This machine is what we'll be using to scan you and see what kind of information we can gather. Okay? Don't worry, it'll be a harmless. Okay. This... I'll be real, I don't trust this thing! <laughs> I'll just boot it up quick and... Hmm, that's odd. It seems to be having issues with retrieving energy from the batteries on the solar panels. Seems like some sort of interference on my southernmost panel that's right at the bottom of the hill. Why don't you go investigate? I'm sure it's a wild Pokemon getting into mischief. Yeah, so you're gonna put us in that machine and be like, yeah, this is a Pokemon fan game. Nothing bad's gonna happen. Don't worry, it's harmless. Yeah, okay. Oh, also, it's like next, it's like near, I wanna make it like daytime, daytime, you know? Let me uh rest. Oh, if I wanna sleep, I change the time of day. Okay, let's sleep. Oh my god, you can sleep 92 hours? Jesus Christ. Me? Good night, chat. Okay. Is this daytime now? It's not. Good night, chat. Good morning, chat. Fuck. I can't tell if this is daytime or night. I'm, I'm just, I'm not gonna like, deal with the daytime anymore. There's a clock in your menu. Oh, it's daytime. Okay, sick. Oh, yeah, what's going on? Who are you? I was instructed to sabotage the solar panel. What will you do about it? Who are you? Team Fate. Grunt would like to battle. Team Fate? Okay. We have an evil... Okay, who, who Megalol are you? Oh, shit. We're not doing any damage. Oh, we got the flinch, though. Let's go. That's huge. Oh, we got the second flinch, though? That's huge. He kind of looks like Teal a little bit. Um, all right, 13. Uh, you know what? We'll, for the Magnemite, we'll send out Nimbus. Yeah, uh, Powder Snow here. Never mind. Powder Snow is actually, like, a terrible one to use on Magnemite. Uh, Nimbus, I want you to gain XP. All right, go Cat. That's fine. That's not okay. Holy shit. Um, I'll just tackle, I guess. Never mind. We're just going to die. Goodbye, cat. Um, okay. Cumulus will send you out. Dude, this Magnemite is fucking wrecking us. All right. As long as we get more flinches, we're good. We seem to be getting really lucky with the flinches. Oh, and by the way, if you are enjoying the stream and you're not following the stream yet... Feel free to uh, follow the stream. Uh, enjoy all that fun stuff, but uh, uh, feel free to follow the stream. Uh, it's, it's fun, we do stuff like this often. Uh, we'll probably be doing this again on Tuesday if you guys really enjoy it. Or we might do Breath of the Wild. Um, oh, I should have used the, okay, that's fine. Or we'll do like Breath of the Wild, like randomizer, one of those two. Um, 
But this is... When you see me playing Pokemon for the next two, three weeks or whatever, um, I will be playing this. And then also, we'll be doing um, uh, a Pokemon fan game or so during the subathon. So, thanks for the follows, guys. I appreciate it. Uh, I'll just directly call you guys out. So, I'll see you guys. Look, that's you right there. Um, but yeah, I also might be editing video slash... Uh, well, not editing video. I might be writing scripts for videos during the subathon. Because I, I still got to do work here, you know? Yeah, doesn't he look like Teal? I'm not sure what the purpose of temporarily disabling his panels is, but I trust my source. Please stand aside. I have to get to the next mission. Interesting. All right, let's, let's go back up. When's the subathon? It is April 10th. Um, it will be uncapped, and one sub will be uh, 30 seconds. Um, but there's also a twist to it that makes it a little bit different than any other subathon, and I will not tell I won't tell you guys until um, April 10th. It's really cool though. We've been talking about it with the mods for a bit, and we're kind of working it all out because the goal about it is um, uh, we're going to do. You can tune in anytime during the subathon. The goal is where you tune in, and it will be content regardless of what's happening. Whether or not I'm asleep, whether or not I'm somewhere else, and it will be content. Um, and you'll be enjoying it, yeah, throughout. That's that's the full goal, you know? Only 30 seconds? Have you seen what Lingus is going through right now? Yeah, because he was a minute and 45, you know? That's... <laughs> Like, I would never do a minute for it. That's too much. We might even bring it down to, like, 20 seconds, you know? So, it's a reverse subathon where your sub uh, retracts time. It's, it is not. I can't confirm that. Nobody has done a subathon like we're going to be doing it. Nobody. And that is a fact. Uh, so, what is the problem? Uh... Yeah, sounds like some scoundrel in, uh, in a sci-fi cosplay disrespecting my personal property. Thanks for taking care of that. The machine is now up and ready to go. When you're ready, just go through the door and stand still. Activating the machine now. Okay, here we go. Here we go, chat. Initializing scan. What? The f what? Oh, it, it's harmless. Don't worry. Nothing bad's gonna happen. Where are we? Do you want to lay down? No, not yet. So I'm sure a machine. The screens are displaying a language you don't recognize. Who are? Who are you? I'm sorry. I cannot help you. I'm sorry, I cannot help you. I'm sorry, I cannot help you. I'm sorry, I cannot help you. Okay, I don't know what the hell's going on. First off, the background is beautiful. I have no idea what's going on. Um, I don't know what happened with us or why her memories are like this, but let's go to sleep, chat. You want to lay down? Yeah. Grill, are you there? Grill, hey! Oh, oh, wake up! Grill, are you okay? Your diagnostics were going all wonky for a second. How do you feel? There were... F I was on a rooftop? You were on a rooftop with four pillars? That is an odd dream. Though you were only there for ten seconds. There's no way you could have fallen into the correct sleep cycle fast enough to... Uh, never mind. Your brain was probably just reacting to the scan you went through. Our brains have the ability to depict a momentary reality from our subconscious, like dreams. It may feel real in the moment, but it's all a trick of perception your mind likes to play sometimes. I don't, I don't know about that, dude. I don't... That sounds like, uh, you're... It, what happened? What is going on? 
Dude, I want to know. This is so weird. Nevertheless, I'll take into consideration while I study the data we just gathered. Well, as long as you're okay, we can continue forward. Maybe this is me just being, like, just, just playing too many Pokemon fan games like Insurgents, Uranium, Rocket Edition, I, that I just don't trust any NPCs. But what happened? I'm going to need some time to go over the data we just collected. While I'm doing that, I need you to head east towards Echo Rock Town. The gadget Wormwood wants me to fix is going to need a whole new battery. It just so happens that the material needed for me to make a new battery is actually in Echo Rock Town's finest export. I believe they are currently wrapping up their annual Koros Festival, so I'm not sure how easy it will be to get your hands on. I'm sure someone in town will be willing to help you out. Just ask them about their Arcanium Ore. Arcanium Ore, okay. So head east from here, you'll end up going through Echo Ridge Cave to wind up in Echo Rock Town. Uh, by the time you get back here, I should have a better idea of what we're dealing with as far as your origins are concerned. If you have enough time, I may be able to get that gadget essentially finished as well. Off you go then. See you in a bit. Wow. Okay, so we're going to head over to Echo Rock Town um, and see uh, and then fix the old gadget that Wormwood wants us to fix. Um, and then come back here and she might have data. Like, Professor Thorne might have data on whatever the hell just happened to us. But we'll check it out. That's crazy, dude. Um, going up and down these hills with luggage sure is making my back sweaty. Yeah, but this is insane. Um, any other questions you guys have about the subathon? I just want to make sure that you guys like know what it is, because um, I've learned very fast. <laughs> I've learned that a lot of people who watch me on Twitch only watch me, which is awesome. Uh, that's that's great. But it's also a little bit, there's like a barrier there of like, what's this? What's that? I don't know what this is, you know? Like, for example, what's a subathon? <laughs> it's, it's a big one, you know? Uh, a... But yeah, uh, will you sleep on stream? Yeah, I'll, I'll be I'll be live on stream for as long as it goes. So, uh, whether or not the stream lasts for a day, or it lasts for three months, that's up to you guys. Uh, I'll bite here. Are you going to do power hours? Uh, probably not. Most likely not, because <laughs> that's, that's a lot, you know? Nice. 14. I got to level up my Nimbus. Yeah, I'll level up um, Nimbus here. Yeah, I, I think a lot of people are comparing my thing to Linkus. Um... As like my subathon, the Linkus subathon, it will be similar, but I want to make it a lot different. Like it, it's not going to be like there. It's like oh, Linkus is gone for this much. Linkus is doing this. Linkus is doing that. That's awesome. Um, but mine's going to be different. You know. Still haven't explained what it is. Um, I've explained it a couple times, but I'll do it one more time. Um, a subathon is essentially I will be streaming for one hour, and every single subscriber I get, I will be streaming an extra thirty seconds. Um, which doesn't seem like a lot, right? But it's uncapped, which means I can be streaming for an hour and 30 seconds, or I could be streaming for three months. Uh, so that's, that's how a subathon works. There's going to be a little twist to it. It's going to be starting April 10th. There's going to be a little twist to it of like, it's going to be a little bit different than everyone else's subathons that they've been doing. Um, I like to put a little, yeah, I don't like to take an idea without like twisting it um, or like putting my own spin on it. So it's going to be a little bit different. Um, most people just do plus 10 per sub dono. Uh, no, most people do it like a minute or like, it depends on your size of stream. Um, like, Linkus is doing, like, a uh, minute 45. I think... I think CJ did, like, three minutes. Um, I'll be doing 30 seconds. And we might even bring it down to 20, depending on... You know? So. Uh, I'll do this all day. In fact, I think it will. Awesome. Go go get that exercise, King. 
Super pal. Nice. Uh, but yeah, we've planned out a full week's worth of content. All 24 hours and everything. So, you know, kind of cool. Seems steep. Yeah, I mean, like, I don't want to stream for... I don't, want, like, I don't think I'm going to stream for a month. You know, <laughs> like... Uh, I'd like, to, uh, I think, I think, uh, I'm gonna stream for, um, like, I'm gonna stream for probably, like, I think, I think the subathon's gonna last a, a week. Uh, I don't think you guys are gonna be able to last more than that. So, we've planned out that much. The camo pad is dark, which means Pokemon can attack at any moment. I would love to stock them and repel before going, though. Um, I'm gonna run from you. Oh, I can't escape. Oh, yikes. So I have to kill you. Have you done a subathon before? Or is this your first? I have not. And also, I've only. The longest stream I've ever done is 19 hours. Yeah, our cumulus kind of isn't the best. Do higher tier subs add more time? Yeah, it's $5 for 30 seconds. So a tier three is $25. So that would add uh, two minutes and 30 seconds. Uh, and a tier two is $10. So that would be one minute. Uh, Linkus and Lud said both it would be a few days. You know what happened with those? Yeah, okay. But Linkus said it was going to be a few days and he put his at like two minutes. All right, like most people do a minute. He's laid his own bed. That that's, yeah. You, come on, you know. Uh, and uh, Lud was like, you know, the first like, and not the first uncapped, but like the first mainstream one. So like, it really meant, you know. Uh, so it kind of got mainstream attention, hence why that one went for a month. And then he got the highest subs, you know. Um. So that's that's that. Um, so it's a little bit different um, than both of those. I've set mine, I think, at a reasonable amount of 30 seconds per sub. Which means if I stream for a week, that would be 20,000 subs. That's a lot. Uh, and I don't, I don't think that's going to happen. So. It's a lot of ice to watch melt. True. Very true. Um, Wismer will change to Cumulus for this. Our mouse went for a month with 30 seconds per sub. Yeah, so we might make it even lower. <laughs> How will you go to the bathroom? I will get up, go to my restroom, and then come back. <laughs> no, chat, I'm not bringing my camera into the bathroom. Who do you think I am? Dr. Disrespect? Nice. All right, all right. So Nimbus is level 10, trying to learn a haze. Interesting. Uh, eliminates every stat change. No, nah, I don't want one haze. So basically 100k for a week. No, it'd be 20k subs. Oh, a hundred thousand dollars. Oh, you guys know I don't. Oh, right. We're gonna have this conversation again. Chat. I don't get five dollars per sub. I don't earn five dollars per sub. You like it would be a hundred thousand spent. Uh, you know, but I don't get five dollars per sub. Yeah. Like I don't like I get like a small fraction of it. Twitch takes a cut. It, I for some reason. Yeah, Twitch takes like half for the average streamer. 
I know, but Bezos makes a share of 100,000. No, Bezos doesn't make 100,000 because half of it would go to the streamer. <laughs> and then taxes. And then also localized taxes too. And then the cuts. Yeah. <laughs> so it's it's not it's it's still a lot. <laughs> it's still a lot, but it's it's not a hundred thousand is what I'm trying to say. You pay your taxes? I know, crazy. Imagine paying taxes. Like I could literally like I the IRS is honestly cringe. Hey, what's up, RT Game? <laughs> I love the IRS actually. I think I I think paying taxes is like so fun. I really just I can't wait for April April to pay my taxes. That's my favorite thing to do. I'm like, dude, IRS, my favorite government agency. Seriously, you know? Like it's You say IRS, I say fun. F U N. <laughs> All right. Uh RT game, thanks for the raid. <clears throat> Uh, for the 2,000 people, welcome in. Um, I saw you were killing God as Kirby uh, earlier in <laughs> on your stream. I, I hope you were enjoying. Uh, if, if you're not following RT Game, come on. You should follow the man, the myth, the legend himself. Jesus Christ. Oh, my lordy. Uh, he's pretty cool. Yeah, IRS, more like IRS to paying taxes, right? Right, right, yeah? No? Maybe? So did he finish, uh, Kirby? I gotta know. Did he finish Kirby? Like, 97%. We almost 100% it? No shot. Okay, that's crazy. How'd you guys like it? Like, good game, bad game, mid game? Okay, that's it seems like a great game psychological horror Okay Okay, um We killed God ultimate God and mega God Jesus Christ I'm glad you had fun chat. I'll have to play it. Um <laughs> uh, Well, if you're coming from RT game stream and you're not following him, please go follow him. He's a fantastic guy uh, He's funny as hell and you're seriously missing out on really good content um so you should watch him um he did a long stream today it was like six, six hours what that? um anyway thanks for the ride i appreciate it if you're um coming into my stream and you're not following me i understand i get it 10 hour stream gross oh my god yeah if you're not following me then uh well you know i understand no i i get it i get it um, I'm doing a Pokemon fan game called Pokemon Infinity. Um, uh, quick question chat. Should I learn Foggy Strike over Nimbus Fist? I'll give you the, the rundown, the story in a second. Um, and what's new. Uh, but it's really pretty. I think Foggy Strike over Nimbus Fist. Yeah. It's, they're both physical and this one never misses. I think so, yeah. Um, all right. Let me give you the rundown real quick. So, this is, first off, the style of game. It's gorgeous. Oh, shit. <laughs> it's goddamn beautiful. Uh, and these are my Pokemon. Um, you can see that we have... They're slightly different. Like, this is Cumulus. You can probably see why I named it. It's cum Cumulus. <clears throat> and then we have uh, the Swablu, a normal ice Swablu, who's also Nimbusy. Uh, <laughs> we have Dog, the cat. We have an egg, and we have Cat the dog. Uh, and then we have Fall Out Boy, who's a dark fighting Spearow. Mom, it's not just a phase, I swear. Um, so hopefully that makes sense. Uh, the story so far is that we woke up in the middle of a forest. Uh, just in the middle of a forest, and no idea what happened. We were, were saved by Professor Wormwood, and he's like, Hey, dude, how did you get on this island? Like, you're on, you're literally in an island. Um, we have no idea you're... It doesn't make sense, right? And this is this is where we woke up, right over here. Uh, and so we are trying to adventure around the island, trying to figure out why we're here, where we came, 
from and uh, any trying to get her memories. So currently, um, we're trying to go to Echo Town. I forgot the actual name of it. It's like Echo Wood Town or something. Uh, and trying to fix this old machine that could read our brain to see our memories. Uh, hopefully that tells you a little bit about it. Uh, but yeah, this is the this is the game, and it's goddamn gorgeous, you know, uh, and all that. Dead Manoroid, thank you so much for the ten gifted subs. I just had to go through that explanation. I appreciate it. Um, and yeah, so that's kind of how it is. Oh, Grill, don't mind me. I'm just uh, second guessing my life decisions. Hey, happens all the time. I did that this morning. <laughs> the truth is, I'm not overly fond of caves. They creep me out. Caves also took are also too dark. You can't even use flash to light them up. I was planning to visit Echo Rock Town, um, which is where we need to go to fix the machine. Uh, but I don't think I'm going to be able to take this route. Uh, that's fine. I can go another way. Small issue, though. I need to drop something off in Echo Rock Town. My grandma made a special blended berry juice, and I promised a friend I'd bring them some. It looked like you're headed to Echo Rock. Would you mind finding them and dropping it off for me? Sir. Sure. Uh, thanks, Grill. Be careful in the cave up ahead. See you around. Is this game new? If I recall, this is a fan game that came out in 2022. So this year? Echo Ridge Cave. Um, or we can go up. Let's see what's in the cave. Okay, you can still kind of go through the cave a little bit. Yeah, this is brand new. I saw this because uh, a friend of mine, A-Rex, was playing this. And I asked him, I was like, hey, is this like a good game? Should I play it? And he's like, yes. Um... There's a couple others that uh, I was recommended as well, but I saw the art style and I was like, yes, beautiful. Huh? A guest, a player, a participant. Welcome to my trick house. I am the trick master. Oh. Anyone have a gun? Don't worry. It's not as weird as it sounds. In fact, trick may not even be the accurate title. It's more like mazes and little puzzles, but it's too late now. I've already decided on the name. Uh, I've been developing a series of challenges for the trainers of Ego, uh, and I've even recruited some help from some of them to add more of a challenge. I've carved out an area to the side of the cliff behind my house, so it's a perfect place for a plethora of pranks. Sorry, no pranks. No deception here, I promise. Okay. If you want to check out my latest challenge, just step on in. Don't be shy. Uh, it's a field guide for Stone Dust. Nah, okay. Uh, and we'll... Dude, what's wrong with your sink? This doesn't look like normal water. <laughs> I just love how the game has some sort of running joke about sinks. It's beautiful. <laughs> there's normal things in the fridge, but there's also gears and bolts. I think he's insane. Okay. Is that rope? Okay. All right, so it's a, it's a literal maze. Okay, I found the great ball. So so this one's a maze. Interesting. Look at me, I, I did it, I think. Oh, no, you have to... You have to go through and, like, press switches, I think? Or something? Yeah, it's a Gen 3 Trick House spinoff. This is really cool. And so I, I just saw some people saying, like, wow, this is a really small map. It's small, but what's cool about it so far... Um, that I've seen is that, like, it's very dense with content. Like, there's a lot of content here. Foggy Strike's pretty sick. So there's, like, it, it seems like they've really, rather than, like, make it big, they've made it, like, okay, rather than make it wide, like, insurgences, right? Rather than be, like, there, this has so many things. Uh, they've made it tall. With, like, it doesn't have much... But what it does is, like, beautiful. And it's nice, you know? That, that's so far. Uh, I'll keep in, uh, I'll keep in Nimbus here. Did they cut the national decks? No, I, oh, that's funny. <laughs> uh, there's, I think, all Pokemon gens 1 through 6 here, plus some Fakemon. Plus, like, 90 new, new things, or whatever. Or, like, 90 new designs. Uh, no, it's not a Nuzlocke either. It's just a regular game. 
What game is this? It's in the title. It's called Pokemon Infinity. Nice. So we have to do two switches here to get this down. I guess the other switch is this way. Oh, what? What? Uh, am I dumb? I am. I, I am dumb. <laughs> the button you seek is not here. All right, Super Nerd Benedict sent out Ralts. Uh, I'll. I'm also like really in the mood for streaming today. Uh, so I'll probably uh. I'll probably stream for a while. Now that I think about it, you know. Would you guys be okay with that? Would you guys be down for a longer stream today? Let's see some nose. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <clears throat> Put yes in chat or you're banned. Is that a yes? My eyes aren't crazy. They're just wide. Put a wide people happy in chat if you have uh, free will. If you have no free will. Uh, I'm gonna switch Nimbus in. I want Nimbus to gain more levels. Nice. All right, so that's the first maze. Good to know. Good to know. Thanks, chat. Oh, uh, open the chest. <laughs> I I have the humor of a twelve-year-old. Hi! It's like a wait. That was like a Zelda. Da -da -da -da! There are items in the chest. Two full heals. And three soda pops. You found a PP pee -pee up. <laughs> Open chests, finds PP up. Hello, you complete my first maze. That's not a surprise. It's nothing compared to what I've got coming up next. Uh, okay. Chat, do we? Do you guys want to keep doing the trick master, or do you want to move on? You have the humor of a 12-year-old and a chat with the level of intelligence of a 2-year-old? That's so mean. But also so true. Oh, do you not have the second one next? Any peepo sitters? Um, okay. Oh, you can believe my first maze? Oh, I guess, oh, let me, I maybe have to go out and back in. No, it's the same one. I guess I have to move on. Uh, like for like gyms or whatever. Captain Juice, thanks to the Prime. What happened with that Abra? Yeah, what happened with the Abra? A manky over there. Huh. Oh, see Nikolai, thanks for the gifted sub. Appreciate that. Go get it? Yeah, I forget where it was. Hey, red apricorn. Uh, I guess I'll like do a little search for it. Was it up here? No, it was. Ramen for life. Thanks for the four months. Oh, maybe it's a different time of day. Oh, no, it's back here. Bro. Best four months ever, everyone should sub. I like I like how you guys in your sub and you in like your sub messages aren't like the, like you're not like, hey, the, you know, I'm so glad I could be here, but a lot of you guys are just like prime, everyone should prime and use <laughs> There's like full plugs for me. I think it's funny. Animation? I dude. Look at this, the art style is just something I adore. Like, this is beautiful. Huh? 
It's so cool. I don't know. I really like it. Okay. Um. All right. I don't know where the. We'll we'll figure out the Abra thing later. We'll we'll move on. I think. Uh. Right. Because we go over here. This is all okay. Yeah. I think we'll move on. I think we'll uh just stay here. I want to see more of this game. It's beautiful. 21 Trapezoid, thanks for the seven months. Don't forget to use your Prime sub. God damn it. <laughs> Zyla, thanks for gifting a sub to Prime Gaming. <laughs> oh, God. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm proud of you guys. Chat, you know what? I'm proud of you. In case you haven't heard that today or recently, I just want to let you know. I'm proud of you. Does anyone redeem the 2 million channel point stream thing? Uh, no. Uh, I think the most points somebody has is like 1.7 million i think it's like mina or blue one of those two or no because shuga used the 1 million i'm pretty sure back when that existed i wish you could see who has what you know they just like twitch doesn't show you because i'll be real with you guys twitch's analytics fucking suck <laughs> and i'll t i'll tell that to their face i think i think it's the weakest thing one of the weakest things on Twitch. And nobody's talking about how shit their analytics are. Like, I want to know. Blue has 1.1 uh, 1 million. Okay. Um, like, I want to know, like, what's when my stream's boring. <laughs> right? Like, I just want to know when my stream's boring. And, and, like, when I how I can make it, you know, more in, uh, engaging. I just want you to, you know... I just want to make it as entertaining as possible. And like Twitch makes it so hard to do that. Cause I have to go to third party websites to figure out what's going on. You know, um, like uh, a while ago, I was like, damn, I don't know why the streams, uh, not doing as well as I, I, I thought it could. And then I had to go to a third party website and I was like, oh, it's cause it wasn't engaging. <laughs> it's like, oh, it's because it, it's yeah. So it's like, okay, I understand now like what's happening. So it's yeah. Anyways, you can't find that through Twitch. Uh, this cave leads to Echo Rock Town. I hope you pack some repels. They'll be helpful in a cave like this. Sick. Um, what's this? Stardust. Cool. Just ask us if, if it's boring. Okay, but you guys... Okay, if I ask you if it's boring, you guys will say yes. Because it's, it's Twitch chat. Because I know you guys. Uh, hey, Twitch chat. Is my stream boring? Told you. <laughs> you can only Twitch. You can only trust Twitch chat so much. Cloutmar, thanks to the tier one. It's better when Abby's here. Look. Abby, Abby can be with us. I'll just play. Is it more entertaining now? No, we're still this is look, it's like as if I love the disappearing woman clip. That's so funny. <laughs> God damn it, guys. All right. It's almost as if She's still with us. It's almost as if I can still hear her voice. Hey, Super Potion. Nice. Um, I'm going to use a repel here. Because I'm going to keep running away. No, this is medicine. Cracked wall. You can dig into it with the right gear. Be careful not to roll off the edge into the abyss. Would you like me to teach rollout to one of your Pokemon? No. Yeah, this is interesting. A cracked wall you could dig into it. I wonder if that's like an HM or something. She disappeared because of the time change time change? Oh, 100 percent yeah. Anonymous, thanks for the hundred bits. This is cool. I like how they did caves. It's really dark, but it's not dark, you know, it's not too dark. A swoo bat. 
Huh? Oh! Oh, our, our egg is hatching. Oh, into a pony top. Okay. Uh, what do we name it? Cow. I hate you guys. <laughs> I hate you guys. You guys are the worst. Also, look, a scam train. Let's go. Thanks for the subs, guys. Appreciate it. Anonymous, thanks for 100 bits. Uh, there are deep pockets of darkness in the cave. Don't get too spooked. Yeah, I'm just glad you guys are enjoying the stream. That means a lot. You need, you need to name everything a wrong animal for the rest of the game. Yeah, so if something has a cloud, we'll name it after a cloud. And then everything else will just be wrong. <laughs> Allurian, thanks so much for these 700 hits. Someone say scam train? That's true. I did say scam train. Oh, you have uh, Orenberry. Um, I'll sing. And it missed, of course. All right, Nimbus is dead. Wait, how? It's uh, cow the cow the ponytail is level one. Oh, what's? Is there anything special about it? Um, it has a. Oh, I haven't even looked at the stats for all of our Pokemon. Let's do that. Oh, yo, S tier HP, A minus special defense. Everything else kind of sucks. Uh, respectfully, you suck. Um, you also kind of suck. You definitely suck. E my like literally S D D minus E minus A E minus E. Fuck. Yo, cat though. Cat's kind of goaded. C minus A A plus A minus B plus. And then Fallout Boy also sucks. What is my what is, what is my luck, dude? Oh, that's gonna kill, isn't it? Oh, it's gonna kill next turn. Oh, it missed. Let's go. And level 16. Nice. Uh oh shit. Now we'll keep in. Leave Fallout Boy out of this. Hey, I'm just saying, Fallout Boy, uh, his stats could, could be better. And someone wants Dunsparce to trade. This is a um, trainer battle. You can't steal Pokemon from trainers. Unless you're playing Pokemon Rocket Edition, in which case that's okay. Oh, yo! Cumulus is evolving! I like it. I like it. Uh, once I learn Gust. Oh, we gained the flying type now. Oh, okay. Uh, we'll have Gust instead of Aqua Ring. Damn. Rename? No, it's still Cumulus. Yeah. Yeah, there's still Cumulus. Uh, let's go over here. Oh, there's more this way. Really hope there's not an electric gym. Yeah, it seems like that. Would you recommend this or Insurgents more? I mean, I've only played two and a half hours of this. And I played 70 hours of Insurgents. Uh, give me a little bit more time. And then I might be able to actually make a... Um, like a... Like a... Um... Which I'm gonna call it. Uh, I'll have I'll have an opinion on this. Uh, so not yet though. Uh, this seems like a really good game so far. Um, we are still learning the story. Low sweep. Okay. We'll still we're still learning the story and like what's going on and like what's happening. 
Oh, wait, that's the, that's that seems to be the actual exit. What's over here? Oh, cool. Oh, this is where... Okay, I know exactly where we are. Okay, and then we can go over here. And now we're at the beginning. You'll need a ground type. Um, to deal with electric. Uh, Pokemon. How about Insurgents versus Uranium? I like Uranium more than Insurgents, I think. Uh, basically, because, like, Insurgents has... So like, Insurgents is overwhelming. You know? But Uranium I like a lot because it's not... It's, like, it's like a very concise story. Um, it's... It's just... It's more... At least on stream, I found it so much easier to explain insurg uh, explain uranium rather than insurgents. Oh, cool. Roar. Um, and I also like the designs a little bit. I mean, I don't know. There's a lot for insurgents. There's a lot that happened. I feel like they tried to make everything... They tried to do everything in insurgents. And where uranium was like, we'll do one thing and we'll do it really well. That's, that's like my opinion on those. Um, I cannot tell you what happened in Insurgents. It's so funny because if you look in the video, um, <laughs> we literally skipped like a full 10 hours of story and, and put it in one sentence. Um, spoilers for Insurgents, by the way. I'm about to spoil it. I'm about to spoil it. So turn off the stream for about like a minute here. I'm about to spoil it. Okay. Here's your warning. Um, so we literally, um, said, okay, uh, I'll tell you, I'll tell you, I'll, I'll, yeah, okay. So basically we literally said like, oh, hey, um, we, uh, I'm, the, the story is so incredibly overbearing that, um, your, like your rival's mother is actually a cult leader and then she gets eaten by a Kyogre. And that was 10 hours of footage to find out that and just that we just summarized 10 because otherwise like it wasn't to the main plot it was just kind of like it was a side thing that made it kind of fun and cool but that's literally it which is crazy so that's like that was a lot for insurgents you know do you think that was the exit too oh i guess it's not the exit it was kind of important yeah, but I kind of had to skip it a bit. Uh, oh, Amplifier. Thanks for the two months. Thank you. Frostmere Crypt. Thanks for the six months. Um, We'll stay in. Ashton, thanks for the tier one. Appreciate that. Okay, well, we'll get all this stuff. Ooh, we got a Quick Claw. Yo, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Uh, Scott, thanks for the Prime. That's a, that's a Psyduck. Any Quick Claw Destiny Bonds in chat? Use as Cloud9, right. Weather the Spirit. Uh, I'll run. I can't escape. Okay. Um, yo, let's catch this thing, I think. Okay, I lied. Let's not. <laughs> um, fuck. Um. Oh, we're dying. Oh, we're so dead. Our only chance is just to catch it, I think. Let's go. Sick. What do we name Psyduck? Perfect. Perfect chat. 
Hidden power. Nice. Uh, Sir Bapo, thanks for the prime gaming. Um, I think I do have revives. I'll, I think I can. Do that. This tree... Oh, uh, that tree be, uh, appears to be moving. That's not a... That's actually really cool. I like that a lot. That's a pseudo-woodo. That's so sick. Okay, let me uh, revive here. We have two revives. Uh, and then we will potion the rest. Might as well use our items. We have... We, I rarely use my items. I feel like I should do more, you know? All right, chat. Do I touch the grass... Yes. Teruto! It's level 17? What the fuck? Um... Dude. Oh my god! I'm gonna fog you straight one more time. Okay. Hey, thank god we're not doing a Nuzlocke, right? Go, cow! Um, and we will use a Pokeball. That was so close. That was really close. Cow coming in the, for the clutch. Um, yeah, go cat. We'll, we'll have cat again. Um, we'll great ball you, I think. Get in the ball, tree. Fuck. Rock throw, yep. That's gonna do a lot. Are you about to white out against a tree? No. No, I don't know what you're talking about. Let's go. We got it. Yeah, Fallout Boy. Level nine. Let's go, dude. Oh, let's set so growl. Oh my god, level 10? Jesus Christ. Alright, what do we name the pseudo Rudo? Oh, technically it is a rock. Oh, I fucked up. Oh, it's technically a rock already. Damn it. I, I got played. Uh, I'm gonna heal. I know. I'm a fool. I got played. Um, okay. Yeah. Oh, no, wait. We can rest up in the trick guy's house. Release and re-catch. Let me just reset my game real quick. Uh, shrubbery! Uh, hey, Eric, I wanted to watch a Pokemon Unbound playthrough on Pokemon on Poker Vods, uh, but the only- uh, the first part's the only one on there. Uh, where can I watch the second part? Uh, I've not done a second part yet. Um, I might restart that playthrough. Donpai, thanks for the five months. I just broke up with my girlfriend. Bless her kind soul enthusiasm made my day better. Uh, sorry to hear about that, my guy. Hey, it always gets better with time. Trust me. I went through a pretty bad uh, breakup like uh, about two years ago now. It's crazy, actually. Um, gets better. Seriously. I know it doesn't seem like it right now, and you're like, ah, oh, God, this sucks. Hey, you're Twitch chat. You don't have time for girlfriends anyways. 
Welcome, welcome to the real stream now. <laughs> you can now fully enjoy Twitch chat. <laughs> you see, beforehand, she was just holding you back, man, right? You can't really enjoy Twitch chat. Oh, now you can see Twitch chat to the fullest. One of us. One of us. <laughs> This is the saddest one of us I've ever done. A peepo chat one of us. Uh, can I? It's not down here, is it? I forgot if it was. Now you can tier three in peepo poggers uwu all you want with no one holding you back. Ha ha ha. Oh my god. Uh, let's see. Any pains in chat? Did you really read that out loud? You see, the thing is, is I... Okay, sometimes, every now and then, I'll like send Lauren like a tweet before I tweet it. And I was like, hey, is this like okay? And she's like, no, it's not okay. Please get help. Um, And then I tweet it. And then... And then Lauren says stuff like that on stream. And and then I wonder, like, am I the strange one? Or is it her? <laughs> I'd actually, I'd show you a recent tweet, but I literally can't show it on Twitch right now because I'm pretty sure I'd get banned. <laughs> but it was really funny. <laughs> Anakin Maseo, thanks for the 23 months. Um, thank you. Almost two old years with this loser. I mean, awesome, wholesome streamer. Thank you. <laughs> Why did Anakin Skywalker cross the road? To get to the dark side. Oh, God. That's funny. Where's the tweet? It's in tweets and replies. Yo, what's up, Thon? Thanks for the 14 months. No, it's not the what's up with airline food. I wouldn't get banned for that one. Uh, all right, we'll keep it with bite here. How much ice are gonna watch melt? Enough, as much as much as it takes. As much ice as it takes to make a point. Tim kid, yo, thanks for the eleven months. Oh, static. Um, okay, I can't switch into. Oh. Actually, yeah, electric types like, like hard counters us. It's the smash one. It's the smash one. Anyways, uh, follow my Twitter. It's really good. I'm very proud of my Twitter. Uh, let's see. I will peck you. Nice. Let's go, Nimbus! All right, chat. Who's your favorite Pokemon of all of the ones that we have currently in our party? Cumulus, Nimbus, Dog, Cow, Cat, and Fallout Boy. Like, who are you, like, rooting for? Like, who's your Pokemon? Big fan of Nimbus. A lot of Nimbus fans here. Occasional Cumulus fan, I see. Oh, we can go through here. Oh, I didn't even know that was an exit. Okay. Cool. So we're in a new part of the cave now. Uh, I see the occasional dog fans. Very okay, nice. Yeah, this is a this is a detailed deep cave. A lot of stuff in here. Tataki Senpai, thanks so much for the gifted sub. Hello, be careful around these giant pits. If you were to fall in them, you might never be found. Oh, okay. Okay, no, that's... That's cool, man. That's cool. I understand the tweet thing now. All right. Do you guys agree 
when I say that my Twitter is unique in a way that no other Twitter is. Oh shit, that's going, yeah, that's going KO. Twitter's really funny. Yeah, I'm trying to bait you guys into saying it's funny without actually saying, like, making you guys say it's funny. I have a few other streamers like that. Dude, Pokemon challenges Twitter? Actually unhinged. Legitimately. Like, holy shit. I gotta, I gotta show you. Um... Okay, um... Wait, chat is virtual streaming right now? I need to know. Uh, if not, I gotta... He is not. Okay, but Sam is. Okay, um... Sorry, that was important. That was important. Okay. Oh, what was it? Oh, I was showing you Pokemon Challenges Twitter, right? That's that's what I was that's what I was doing. Uh, let me see if I can show. Um, smoking on that shit made nose pass. Um she on my dick because I'm the illest MC, Petalburg Forest, she's looking for my miracle seed. She holding my thick club till my bone rush. Uh, parents will cut off a part of their kid's penis because they're afraid he'll get bullied in the locker room and then name them Keith. Uh, oh, here's a funny one. Um, I had a sponsor reach out to me a few weeks ago offering an insane amount of money to mint NFTs of clips of me playing Pokemon Gold and Silver. Sorry, I have principles as a content creator. No amount of money will offered me. Uh, no amount of money offered will get me to play Gen 2. <laughs> Jerking your meat must have hit so much harder back when everyone thought the punishment for it was eternal torture. Jesus Christ. Oh, there which one was the one about uh let me find the Kirby one. Cause it's it's topical. I gotta find the Kirby one chat. Give me a second. It's worth it. Oh, why are there so many My Little Pony stuff on there? Oh, God. There's so, why is there so many My Little Pony stuff? When was it announced again? Like, when, when was uh, Kirby announced? It was this year, right? Oh, there it is. I found it. That's the tweet. That's the tweet. Anyways. So, if you guys thought that my Twitter was, um, unhinged, I implore you to, um... Rethink. Oh, Limbus, uh, Nimbus is using uh, learning Razor Wind. Uh, sick, yeah. Oh, it's two turns. Oh, is Razor Wind good? I, it doesn't look like it. Prezos is also really good. Prezos is unhinged. Did we learn Razor Wind chat? 
No? Okay. What is this? Just an ice block? Okay. More stardust. Ooh, a great ball. Nice. Trying to run away from the swoo bat. Yeah, there's a lot of ice here. Oh, you scared me. You should really have a cool hat with a light on it. Can you give me one? <laughs> Appreciate that. Uh, are you here to help me work? Oh, God. Ali B, thanks for the seven months. I was excited to watch Thursday stream, but I almost died and had to go to the hospital. Damn, we almost got her. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed Delta in chapter two. Uh, glad to be able to catch the stream. Uh, I'll roost here, because we need to survive. Never mind. We're just gonna let powder snow? Damn it, dude. We have we our Pokemon are not we we got some weak Pokemon right now. Uh we're struggling currently. Not unhinged. Hey Allie B. I'm glad I'm glad you're okay. <laughs> In case that's okay. Prez's most recent tweet outshines all of Pokemon challenges. I'm not reading that out. <laughs> that's that's on that is unhinged. Uh I won't change Pokemon, I'll stay in here. That's gonna kill. You do know there's a Pokemon Infinity category, right? Yeah, uh, but I don't know why you guys care so much about the category of what I'm in. That's, that's for me as a streamer to care about, and uh, you as a viewer to not care about. <laughs> I, I, will, I will be streaming. You don't have to stream for me. I got it. Don't worry. Um, appreciate the help, but I think I know what I'm doing. Um, I only say that not because like of a one shot, but it's 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 um, because whenever I stream Pokemon, normally a lot of people only stream in a like the Pokemon category of like Legends Arceus. I'll, I'll explain it just so it doesn't seem like an asshole about this. Um, um, right. So if you go to Legends Arceus here, you can see you know Pokemon Infinity. You can see Blaze Black Two, um, Volt White Two, Blaze Black Two, BDSP. Like nobody's streaming. Like, this is the Pokemon category, essentially. Right? Um, and I... Whenever I stream Pokemon, I always get that question. Um, so it's, like, a constant thing. Um, so it's, like, a general thing of, like, Ah, I got it. Don't worry. <laughs> like, yeah, just enjoy the content, you know? Hopefully that, like, kind of makes sense. Boy, okay, thanks for tier one. Um, Okay. Let's see. I will bite here, but you're probably still... Yeah. Unless you, like, flinch? Yeah, let's go! Pokemon. Twitch should make a Pokemon fan game category. Twitch should just make a Pokemon category. That would solve a lot of issues. But... It's Twitch. They don't really know their own website. That's true. Okay, we're gonna die here. I'm pretty sure we're gonna faint. Nintendo would try to shut that down of Twitch making a Pokemon category. Oh, Pokemon fan game category. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah the Twitch website is held together by hopes and dreams. What category did you use before Legends Arceus? Uh, Brilliant Diamond, Shining Pearl. And before that was Sword and Shield. And before that, was all just sent off. Um, okay. So, let's do PC. Thorin's PC. Let's 
Organize boxes. What the fuck? Oh, okay. Uh, so let's take out our rock and replace cow. I'm sorry. Goodbye, cow. Uh, and we'll take in goose and replace cat or dog instead. Uh, here we go. Uh, parents said I. Thanks for the 11 months. Sorry, that wasn't meant to be like... I, I didn't mean to come across as like mean or anything about that. Um, uh, sorry, I, I know I come across mean or sassy sometimes. Um, uh, I've been trying to prevent that. Uh, it's... Uh, I'm just trying to explain a little bit of like... Um, things. Uh, but yeah, that's like why Pokemon streamers like... Or like people streaming Pokemon, I should say. Uh, stream in like the most recent Pokemon category it's because there's more overall viewers in the in like the recent like Pokemon categories and then it's just easier for like it's like it's like if I if I move to the Pokemon infinity let me show you this um, let me explain it a little bit better um, okay so if I go to browse right and I'm like oh, I want to find Pokemon you have to scroll down to like here to find a Pokemon game right pretty pretty far if you want to find Pokemon Infinity, <laughs> I got it. I got no, 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 guys, I got it. Give me, give me a second. Uh, all right. I'll also say like, that's that's kind of fake because realistically, I would um, 2000s. Uh, we'd probably be about right here in the list, but it's still a lot to scroll, you know. Um, versus Legarcius, where there's a lot more people. How it works on Twitch. Um, okay. Um, and it's, like, just, like, overall better. Hopefully that makes sense. Um, it's, like, min-maxing a thing, and it doesn't really matter, like, at all. Like, if, if, if you come in, like, I don't know. I don't see many people complaining about it, so. Um, technically, it's, like, Twitch is, like, yo, you should be in the right category, but specifically, like, fan games-wise, I think, like, Pokemon Unbound doesn't have a category. Pokemon Reborn doesn't have a category, if I recall. There's a lot of fan games that just don't have categories um, as well. So it's like, you know. Hopefully that kind of makes sense. You've been in this cave for a year? I know! I've been wanting to get out of this cave, dude! This is the worst! You had to guess how many Pokemon fan games have you played? Uh, I played Insurgents, Uranium, Unbound, Xenoverse, Rocket Edition, and now I've, I'm playing Infinity. But we never finished Unbound. So we'll have to do that again. Um, okay, so we'll go all the way down here. Oh, no, I think we, we went to the left, right? We're looking for a ladder. Wait, did we go down? Shit, I forget where we went. No, it wasn't over here. Oh, it was to the right. It was to the right a little bit more. It was right here. Yes. That's where it was. I can barely remember the plot of Unbound. I don't personally remember the plot of Unbound. So we'll have to start again and, and all this stuff, you know. Check the stats of Pokemon you had to the team. Good idea. All right, let's check, let's check stats of uh, Goose. Yo! A plus special. Actually, Goose isn't bad. You have Water Gun, Confusion, Psy Wave? Okay. Uh, Rock, not bad. Wow, look at that speed. Damn. Okay. Low Kick, Rock Throw, Mimic Slam. Okay, not bad, not bad. I'll take it, I'll take it. Um. <laughs> not shit is, is, is a good thing, you know, there. 50% of the gameplay has been in caves. Literally just for this. Oh my god. Uh, 
I do understand the reasoning behind it, but normal games like Emerald, for example, I don't like searching through a category that encompasses all Pokemon games. I see it for fan games and such. It works. Okay, the reason why I do it is because I am top category, um, which is slightly different too, right? Um, so if, if I was new streamer, then I would not stream in Pokemon Legends Arceus. I would stream in Pokemon Emerald. Uh, because then I would be the top of the cat. Like, the category matters more. So I am the top of the highest... I am the, currently the, the top streamer of the highest viewer Pokemon. That, so that's why it makes more sense as bigger streamer to do that versus smaller streamer to be in a top of, like, Pokemon Emerald. Right? Which I think for Pokemon Emerald... Uh, if you had more than 11 viewers, you would be the top one. Right? Because top of category gets more discoverability than, uh, just, it's, it's, it's a lot, you know? Uh, it's, sorry, sorry if I'm, like, over-explaining this. Um, but top of category, you'll always get more people with eyes on your stream than anything else. So it's me min-maxing, because Twitch discoverability is uh, fucking garbage. <laughs> so I'm min-maxing discoverability on a website that doesn't have any. Very small, if that makes sense. Uh, okay. Let's see where to go. I I'm sorry, I don't have any repels. I used them all up, you know? Oh, shit. Ah, oh, come on, Swoobat. I enjoy hearing the intricates of Twitch analytics. I'm glad you do, you know? <laughs> I'm glad you do. Because it's very interesting to me, at least. Um, Do I go this way? I mean, I, I think it's an interesting game. Taxes for streamers must be so fun. I literally I have planned a day. I'm like, all right, Abby, we're sitting down and we're doing taxes this day. I don't like literally cancel everything because we're just doing taxes that day. It's a lot. Would you play a fan game where streamers are the Pokemon? So I'd basically be like, I would be using like Linkus to fight against an Atrioc. A lot of ice over here. Interesting. I just want to make sure like that's, that's where you're, yes. That could that'd kind of be funny. Yeah. That'd actually be funny. I'd be down. Go purple cliff. Use Splash! Yeah, or like maybe the moves are like different. As like XQC uses six consoles. One Crow uses Ask for Prime. Uh, I'll keep in Nimbus. Oh, yeah. Purple Cliff uses Ghost Place left. Big one. Shit. Yeah, our Nimbus is not powerful at all. But, yeah, that'd be cool. That'd be pretty sick. I would be down to play it. Also, uh, yeah, if you guys are enjoying the stream uh, and you're not... Um, if you're enjoying the stream and you're not following it yet, feel free to follow the stream. Uh, we do stuff like this often, so I'm glad you guys enjoy so far. Dog Dog just uses confusion. <laughs> That's funny. Nice, level 18. We're trying to use Tailwind. Oh, yo, Tailwind's pretty sick. Um. Oh, what do you think, guys? Do I use Tailwind?
Oh, I guess, yeah, it's not a Nuzlocke. Yeah, I'll, 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 I'll stop wearing Tailwind. It's not a Nuzlocke, so I don't really matter too much, you know? It's okay. I think we'll be fine. Okay. Oh, uh, and we'll have... Yay! Great ball! Awesome. Okay. Uh, heart scale. I would like to heal my Pokemon somehow. Or get out of this cave, preferably. Alright, looks... Oh! Oh! We're almost out of the cave, chat! What? Revive. Nice. I can use that for later. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh my god. Look at the balloons for the festival. How's it going, my guy? Hey kid, welcome to Echo Rock Town. My name is Treant. Oh, what was that? You're looking for some Arcanium ore? Well, you come to the right place. This town's main export is Arcanium. Hey, to break it to you, though, the smithery is closed uh, during the Kroros Festival. I happen to have some working on me, though, uh, from working earlier. This stuff ain't cheap. You can't just give it out to anyone. Hmm. I'll tell you what. You see that older gentleman down there? That's Gerald. He's one of the Ego Council, uh, Council members. If you can beat that guy in a Pokemon battle, I'll give you the biggest chunk of Arcanium ore I found today. If you lose, then I guess you'll just have to come back and buy some when the festival is over. Sick. Okay. Um, for Raleigh, thanks for the 10 months. 19 months. Jesus, it's been that long. Oh, my God. I go Rich Kate. All right. I'm going to save here. Um, and then I'm going to go to the bathroom real quick. Okay. And then we're going to explore and see what's up. Um, I'll also, like, leave you guys with the music and, and kind of the vibe. Like, this is just, like, a background, you know? It's so pretty. Um, all right, I'll be right back. Uh, Peepo sit while I'm gone. Uh, sit tight. I'll go get some water and stuff too. Um, and yeah, I'll be right back. Or you can veg, you know, you can sleep. Whichever one you'd like. Oh, also, uh, if you're coming in, I will re-explain the plot, uh, and what's happening when I come back, uh, so then you guys can know exactly, uh, what's happening. Yay.
Hello. I'm back. How are you guys doing? My Twitch chat. <laughs> Hello. Uh, all right. I'm. Ooh, I got. I got um. Uh, some food stuffs. I got some water. I woke up. Chat. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Um. And uh, yeah. Did you guys like the vibe? Did it? Oh, it changed color because it's becoming like nighttime, isn't it? Uh, like in in game. That's so sick. What food? I've had this sitting with me for a bit. Um, it's like pork belly rice or whatever. It's really, really good. I like to uh, use this with it. It's I know it's like backwards. It's ghost pepper sea salt. It's really good. Here, can you guys like see it? Right? It's pretty sick. So then I like to sprinkle it on my uh, my foods. I love that camera, by the way. Like this camera is so sick because it focuses so well. It's not that spicy. It has like a little kick, you know? You can see your cuticles. <laughs> you can see, I've been working on Ikea furniture. I have like little abrasions on my fingers and hands. And then uh, YouTube gave me this. That was my YouTube plaque. I, uh... I scratched my finger on my YouTube plaque. YouTube's out to kill me. Did you build a bedside table though? I did not. I helped build a, a bookshelf. Mm. Chat, let me show you. Look at this. Uh, that's a bookshelf of, um, half of my manga collection. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> half? Yeah. I'm building another bookshelf for the other half. Anyways, where'd you buy the salt? It's from the Spice and Tea Exchange. Uh, Spiceandtea.com. Actually, highly recommend it. Not sponsored or anything. It's like, just really good. <laughs> What's up, Lucy? Grill, hey, I thought I might find you here. I was flying over here on one of my Pokemon when I saw you enter the other side of Echo Ridge Cave. Professor Wormwood had me running errands and I thought I'd stop by Echo Rock Town especially since it's their annual Koros Festival. The festival originally started as a celebration of Palkia, the space deity. According to the people of Echo Rock, Palkia is the Pokemon that saved Echo 100 years ago. I wasn't born yet, but I heard the tale enough times. They continue to hold the festival in remembrance. The festival is just concluding. Howlett and the other town folk are building... Bleh. The festival is just concluding. Howlett and the other town folk are bidding farewell to the caravan at the southern exit. I try to enjoy what remains of the festival. As for me, I'm going to head through the cave you just came from. Uh, it's been a while since I had a good stroll through Echo Ridge Cave. Here, you can have this before I go. I've already taught it to some of my Pokemon. I figure it can help you out around the island. Get around the island quicker. Fly! Okay. One thing is, uh, you'll need the certification badge to use it basically like a license that is required for you to use uh, certain TMs in Echo. Um, it comes in the form of a badge. Your luck, though, the person who gives that specific badge is actually right here, right now. 
Maybe you can convince them to give it to you. Usually it just requires that you beat them in a battle. We'll see you later, Grill. Don't forget to stop by the lab sometime if you're not too busy working with Professor Thorne. Okay, so we get Fly for being the first gym. Or the first council, I think it is. Will you show us the manga collection one day? Curious. Um, Probably during the subathon, yeah, actually. Uh, do you want to hear the tale of the day Palkia saved us all? Chat, do we want a lore dump? Do you guys want to hear about the lore? No? You're, uh, then you're wrong. We're saying yes. Uh, you want to hear it. It's always, like, that's always a yes. Because they're always interesting. It was around 100 years ago. A nefarious group of people that dwelled in Dunestone Desert stole our Azure Flute. They used it to summon Giratina in hopes of harnessing its power to warp reality. Lucky for all of us, Palkia showed up and saved the day. Palkia used its cosmic power to seal Giratina away forever. The battle between them resulted in the destruction of the Chaos Temple. Some people say Dialga also played a part in Save the Day, but that doesn't fit our narrative. <laughs> okay. Uh, Ego Rock Down, the home of the Move Relitter, and uh, Ego Elder Jim. Doors locked. There's a note on it says that has says Happy Koros. Wow, look at this. That's a beautiful statue. Uh, a statue depicting the deity of space, Palkia. Whoa. Please don't mess up our rhythm. We perfected it uh, for the Koros Festival. Oh no. Oh no, I fucked it up. Oh, Chad, I I, I fucked it up. Oh shit. Uh, 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 no, you guys look fine. <laughs> Maybe I'll talk to you and I'll fix it. Uh, it's, it's close. They're kind of fixed. Right? <laughs> I used to be a dancer for the festival when I was younger. Oh, what I wouldn't be able to move, give to be able to move like that again. Uh, is this the Pokemon Center? Oh! I like the different theme here, too. It's kind of sick. Welcome to the Pokemon Center. We were sorry to tell you. Yeah, right. Classic. That's actually... I'm, I'm digging it, you know? Um, okay. Uh, chat, do you want me to re-explain the lore? With a storyline? Uh, the PC allows you to store items. Right. That means you can quantify an entire complex living organism down to just numbers. If we could do that, imagine what we could do if we merged a human brain with a computer. The cave is a great place to train water fighting and grass-type Pokemon. Yep. Yeah? Okay. So I'll, I'll, I'll explain what's happening so far. We wake up in the middle of a forest. Uh, and we are uh, found by Professor Wormwood. Upon... Waking up in Professor Wormwood's uh, guest house, uh, we, he tells us, essentially, um, Hey, nobody knows who you are, and you've just appeared randomly on this region. And we're like, How? okay. And he's like, yeah, you're in the middle of an island. Like, nobody knows what happened. Who are you? Where'd you come from? And we don't remember. So it's our goal right now to figure out what the hell just happened and regain our memories. So Professor Wormwood uh, told us to find Professor Thorn. Uh, we talked, we go over, talk to Professor Thorne, um, and she tasks us, uh, with fixing her machine, uh, so that we could find what's out, what's inside of her brain. So, we're in Echo Rock Town right now, uh, trying to get some ore to fix the machine so we can s regain some of our memories, possibly. And that's the lore so far. Uh, and yeah, so, uh, in order to get the ore... Um, from this guy up there, um, we need to defeat the gym leader, which is this guy, who we haven't talked to yet. When this game came out? I think this released in 2022. Hello there, young... Oh, wait a minute. Uh, you must be that child that Wormwood found asleep in the woods. I can't tell because I don't recognize you and I've met everyone there is to meet on this island. A pleasure to meet you. I hope you are faring nicely on our island aside from your confusing predicament. Oh, sorry. My name is Geralt. I'm one of the older members of the Ego Council. I'm just here to observe the ending of the Koros Festival. I grew up in Echo Rock, so it's a tradition of mine to try to attend the festival every year. 
As of right now, I reside in Hayesport City on the southern coast of Ego. If you get time for it, maybe you can stop by and see me for a battle? Anyways, I'm going to return my attention to the ongoing festival. It was nice to meet you, and I wish you well in your travels. Okay. Uh, welcome. Alright, so you're gonna sell me... Oh, a lot of stuff. Heal powders, Moo Moo Milk, Mommy Milky, Moo Moo Mom. Uh... Uh, Rage Candy Bars, and, uh, Castellia Cones. Nice. Um, let's do, let's use, let's buy a bunch of heal powders. Uh, like, six of them. And then, uh, we'll buy a bunch of energy roots as well. So we'll do six of them, too. Alright, uh, quit. There we go. Uh, we could sell our Stardust, but that's fine. Uh, but anyways, uh, did I explain the lore well? Like, are we, like, kind of caught up? I mean, Dialga also needs some recognition for the way it helped protect us. You wouldn't catch me saying that in this town, especially on this day. Yeah, it's pretty simple. Uh, we wake up, and we're trying to regain our memories. Uh, we have the festival every year. I'd rather be sleeping than wasting time praising the same Pokemon we've praised for years. How do we even know the stories about Palkia are true? None of us were there to witness it. Valid. Hello. Uh, my parents are so distracted by their scale and shard collections, they won't spend any time making good food. We don't even have a kitchen. A friend of mine from Sea Ridge Town told me he's going to bring me a special treat that his grandmother made. Oh, oh, which we have. Is that a blended berry juice you're holding? That was the treat my friend was going to bring. Oh, you ran into my friend Donnie. Okay, so his name's Donnie. The shiny guy. His name's Donnie. Uh, that's great. Thank you for bringing me the juice. It was super nice of you to deliver it for Donnie. Hope he gets over his fear of caves soon. I don't have much to repay you for your troubles, so I guess you can have this rock I found? Uh, oh. You just gave us a rock. Okay. This town is known for rocks. It makes sense I would pay you with one. It's just a rock. It can be used to do rock things. Thanks. Thanks, man. I... I appreciate it. <laughs> Hi there. I like to collect colored shards. Uh, I like to compare the sizes and hues. I also have more Pokemon eggs than I know what to do with. Uh, I do not have any shards. Um, yeah. Uh, and you have the Pokemon Move Maniac. Um, and you like Heart Scales, which I think we have one. Um, sure. Which Pokemon... Like, can we... Does Cumulus know anything? Um, like anything important? Rain Dance, I guess? Nah, it's okay. Um, okay, sick. Yeah, so that's kind of cool. Um, and we'll go down here, we'll gain all this stuff. This is pretty- oh, a Honeydew Berry, nice! Or a Hondu. And we got Charcoal, which we don't need yet. I would like a Mystic Water. Chimeco. A chime is it Chimeco or Chimeco? I never know the pronunciation of Pokemon names. Okay. Can I, can, can I, can I, can I, can I escape, please? Can I please escape? Can I, just, there we go. Thank you. <laughs> it's like Manga W. Uh, oh, what is this? The door is locked. There's no one it so that says closed in observance of the Koros Festival. Okay. Um. Uh, have we missed anything? Oh, yeah. There's a lot of stuff over here. Oopsies. Uh, sorry. The temple is closed during the Koros Festival. Oh, that's the Kiros Temple or whatever. I wish I had some money to throw in the well. Legend says if you throw enough, it will awaken a special Pokemon. Sounds like an easy way to scam some poor sucker. Those who show generosity will be rewarded in spirit. Would you like to throw some money in? How much? A thousand dollars. Oh. Why? The well did not respond. <laughs> All of it?
I just threw in all of my money. I just- I just threw in all of my- Are you si- I'm poor! You told- chat, you told me to throw- I hate you guys. I wish I had some money to throw in the well. Legend says if you throw enough, it'll awaken a special Pokemon. Sounds like a way to scam a poor sucker. Okay. Stop definitely laughing, all right? Hey, hey, all right? It, it's just, I just needed to, maybe you didn't throw it enough? Stop. They're playing a melody on their flute. Listen, yes. Pretty. Probably need like 10K. All right, shut the fuck up. Um. All right, he won't battle me. If you can be draw in the battle, I'll offer you a chunk of Arcanium Ore for free. I need to battle you now, my guy. I have a full battle ready team right now, so I don't think you want to battle. It's just a few. Uh, it's just a few new friends that decided to tag along for the festivities. Wait until I can give you a real challenge. What's that? You want to battle right now? Yes? Let's do it. I guess the party I brought with me will have to do. Alright, let's make this quick. I've got festivities of Baskin. Ego Elder Geralt would like to battle. Dude, battle music kind of slaps. I like the remix. Oh, Sparks don't kill. We're flying type. Or no, no, we're, we're, we're normal ice. Uh, I, was, I was hoping for a freeze there. That's okay. Nimbus is going to go down. Um, but we'll send in... Rock. Um, and we'll low kick you. That's okay. That's not going to do much. Ah, oh, come on. The paralysis though. I should have used Rock Throw. Uh, yeah, I'll Rock Throw again. What a bop! Oh, we're paralyzed. It's like a 50% chance, I think, for par paralysis to not move. Perfect. I should have used Rock Throw from the start. It's stabbed, too. Uh, I'll keep in Rock. No rock throw. That's gonna do a lot. That's gonna do a lot. Um, we go second. We're, we're gonna die here. I should I should have healed. Point curve doesn't know his types. Uh, part fifty-seven. It's actually not the easiest in the world. I also like the level caps 150. I wonder if we're going to get to level 150 in this game, you know? Do you think so? Cause it, like in Pokemon Insurgents, we literally got to level 100. And the level cap for that's 120. Is that the hardest in the world? It'd be fine. Okay, good to know. Bro! I'll side wave here. Okay. Um. Shit. Uh, let me revive Nimbus. Or no, I should I should revive uh um whatchamacallit? Pseudo Wudo. I am it seems like I'm underleveled, yeah, for sure. They'll send a Nimbus. Okay, it's <laughs> I was like, it's so quiet. It's so quiet. Alright, cat, here we go. Pico blesses, guys. We can we can pull this out.
Um, I'll heal powder. Rock, I think. I think Rock's the one to go. Wait, it won't have any effect. Wait, what do you mean? The fuck? What, what do you mean the fuck it won't have any effect? What? Oh, it's status problems. I did the wrong one. Oh my god. Oh my god. I thought it was the revive one. Uh, our only hope is... Never mind. Good thing I was scammed from the well so I didn't have to pay you money. Ah, you see, you guys were thinking uh, in checkers. Why, meanwhile, I was thinking in tic-tac-toe. I don't have a full battery right all right. Um, wait until I give you a real challenge or I can battle you right now, yes. Train, please. I don't need a train. I can just bash my head against the wall until it works. Sparks don't kill. Two sparks are gonna kill. Oh, look at that crit though. Okay. Um, I'll send in a uh, rock here, and then I will rock throw. Gym have themes or types in this game. I have no idea. I, I'm learning with you guys. I don't know anything about this game. So I, I'm i figuring out as you guys are too. It's That's kind of like the fun part of it, you know? I don't want to know, are there Mega Evolutions? I, I, I think there's no Mega Evolutions, but I just think it's like nice, you know? Um, all right, we're gonna keep in here and I'm gonna use Low Kick for you. Cause you're poison type, right? Never mind. Uh, fighting types actually like really. No <sighs> Fuck. Uh, I'll wait for rock throw and I'll send in cumulus. Poison ground. Oh. Um. Okay. I will just foggy strike here. It'll be good. I also get poison from poison point. I'm pretty sure for that. No, but it's likely. Ah, and the poison sting, dude. <laughs> Please. Please. This is not going well. Although we are level 19, I'll take it. Oh, uh, no. Imagine if your opponent's Pokemon gained levels during the fight. That would be insane. That's going to kill. Um, all right, then we'll rock throw with rock. That's fine. Super effective. Let's go. Let's go. And then rock. Oh, please. Easy. First try, dude. First try. Let's go, rock. Nice job, kid. Hell yeah. And we got money that we can dump into the fountain. Great job, kid. You're surprisingly competent for someone who just woke up with amnesia. As an Echo Council member, I'm required to reward trainers with the Quill Badge if they best me in battle. Even though this wasn't as official of a battle as I would have preferred, I'd be more than happy to follow through with my sworn duties. Hey! We got our first badge! Okay! Very informal, but I'll take it. With that badge, you are now able to fly around to different points in Ego that you've already been to. Like I said, find me in Hayesport City if you'd like to experience a real battle. There are four more Ego Council members around the island. One of the other ones, Howlett, actually lives here. He's saying goodbye to the caravan. As for me, I'm going to get back to enjoying my time here. Cool. Nice. Okay. Um, all right. So I guess we can continue on our journey. 
Uh, we do have fly, which is important. Also, um... Nice. Uh, oh! A Pokemon spray out of the well. Oh, okay! It's a fucking Weedle. <laughs> oh. It's a level 20 Weedle. It's a level 20 Weedle! Dude, this thing's gonna kill Nimbus! Oh my god. Oh, I get it! Because weed! Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense! Wait. So the, the 420 actually did something. Okay. Let me grape ball you. It's level 20, I gotta catch it. All right, sick. Uh, what do we name it, chat? So what if I put in Nice <laughs> Nice All right, good to know. Um what if I do like 6 9 Six. Uh, I gotta stop. I gotta stop wasting my. Oh, what if I put six, six, six? Shit! Oh, Chad, I threw in. Oh my! I accidentally threw in money into the well. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Whoopsies. I'm literally throwing. Any. Can anyone spare a prime? <laughs> so I can get more money to throw in the ground? Uh, alright, let's- let's go, uh, um, do over this way. North Rock thanks for the prime! Alright, uh, let me- let me sell here, thanks. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, let me sell a Stardust. Yeah, I'll still start up. Uh, Flint Gaming, thanks for the Prime as well. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> Thank you. Maybe now I can actually do the 666. Xylian, thanks for gifting the sub to another Prime. Okay. So 666. A Pokemon sprang up behind the well. Ah, Houndoer! Oh, that's that's pretty that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Dude, my sings aren't working. Oh, I, I like it. I like it. Um. All right, I'll get it too. Actually, I don't know if I should. It's only level fifteen. Our Nimbus is level eleven though, so. Yeah, I, I think I'm gonna run from it. Never mind. I can't escape it. Um. I'll just try to catch it with a dust ball right now. Oh! That worked! Sure! Nice! Alright, what do we name the Houndur?
We already have a cat and a dog. Kitty. Um, wait. Let me watch here is the game completed yes that's why I'm playing it I don't play fan games that are not completed oh damn it all right uh all right let me do 777 not so lucky fuck <laughs> I tried Throw in zero? Can you? How generous. <laughs> That's so funny. All right, let's uh let's change around our team now. Okay. Um, thorns. Okay. So organized. Let's um. Yeah, I always like. I like how self-aware the game is. Uh, let's change it for. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Say bye to cat chat. We'll replace cat with kitty. Bye, Fallout Boy. Although, I kind of want to see Fallout Boy's like actual evolution. I think we'll keep in Fallout Boy. I think the rule is that we keep in like Fakemon. You know. It's still nighttime. Okay. Um, let's continue on with the story. Let me save real quick. Let's continue on playing. We get rid of Nimbus. No, Nimbus is a um, Nimbus is a uh, new Pokemon. That's Water Flying, Normal Ice, right? Um, we already know the stats of you and the suit of the Rock. All right. So Weed stats are mid. Very mid. Wanna do? Thanks for the tier two subscription for 21 months. Welcome back. Thank you for that tier two. And fall up point. All right. Okay. Uh, the door's locked. There's no closing no observance of a course festival. Um, where am I supposed to go then? Oh, I need to talk to the cave guy. Right, 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 right. I forgot about that. Um, is there like, can I sleep? I guess not. It's nighttime and I don't like the optics of, of this right now. Levinson, thanks for the three months. Can I make it daytime? Somehow? Oh, they're going down. Oh, okay, that's what we need to ask. After the subscription ends, do you keep, still keep the emotes or do you lose them? You lose them. Craft a bed. Yeah, just get three wool. Um, yeah, Levinson, thanks for three months. You did it! Geralt is one of the strongest trainers in Echo. I was certain you'd lose. You're just lucky it wasn't battle ready today. Wow, it's, it's copium, you know? <laughs> uh, I was just really good at the game. Uh, it doesn't matter. I'm a man of my word. A deal is a deal. Arcanium ore. Let's go. Always a pleasure to meet a fellow mineral fan. Hope you can do something useful with the ore. Oh, also, um, let's teach Fly, uh, to one of our Pokemon. Uh, I think Cumulus, actually. Fly is better than Gust. Yeah. Nice. You could already fly? No, I had to beat the, the trainer guy. Okay, cool. Uh, and then let's go down here and talk to the... Uh, let's talk to what's going on here. Uh, it's been a long time since I've heard a tune played from the Azure Flute. I was fortunate enough to be a part of the Chorus Caravan when I was young. The Mule and Echo believe that the Palkia and Dialga are to thank for protecting our island all those years ago. Those people are wrong. <laughs> Palkia is the one that deserves the credit. Okay. All right. Understanding. When the caravan goes off to uh, Palkin Heights, they're... When the caravan goes off to Palkin Heights, they're usually accompanied by the strongest trainer in town. 
Each year, the caravan heads up to the Koros Temple, located at the top of Palkin Heights. They play their Zuru flute to summon Palkia just so they can thank it for all its help those years ago. There's like a trillion Pokemon. What makes Palkia so important? Bro! Um. Alright, we'll fly. Oh. Wait. Oh, you can you don't have to teach fly. You can just fly if they can. Oh, okay. Cool. Let's go back to Thorin's lab then. So we can give her the uh the ore. Oh, it's raining. Interesting. All right, currently it's th it's uh 103 a.m. So I want to sleep for a five hours. Good night. Good morning. <laughs> You're finally back. Uh, you got your hands on some Arcanum ore and you won a badge? Fantastic work, kid. I knew you would pull it off. Now, I've got some good news and bad news. Oh, uh, which one do we want? Uh, do we want to learn the good news first or the bad news first? Bad news? All right. The bad news is I need a little more time than expect to figure out what's going on. I've eliminated a handful of possibilities and I'm quickly honing in on what I think the answer is. I'm currently adjusting the satellite settings to scan for cosmic microwave radiation in the... Oh, never mind. My point is that it's going to take a bit more time, but I'm confident I'll be done soon. Luckily for you, I have one more errand to send you on to keep you busy. Is that the good news? <laughs> Bad news, it's going to take you more time. Good news, you get to do more work. <laughs> I know, I know. It feels like I'm just using you to do my bidding. You got that right. Well, I am. Okay, <laughs> but it's not like you have much else going on. Anyways, I've been invited to be a guest at the Safari Zone grand opening in Amberfield Town. They commissioned a solar panel for me to help run the new facility. Even though the owner has paid me, he thinks I would, for some reason, want to be honored at this event. I've got more productive things to do, and I really don't want to waste my time with that. I've written him a letter detailing my thoughts on the matter. Uh, you would just need to deliver it to him. So you, you're sending a strongly worded letter to the host of a... Like grand opening, or the host of like a of a festival or whatever, and we're delivering it. Okay, you essentially be going in my place just to let him know I'm not going to be able to make it. Okay, it's the most polite way to reject his request that I could come up with. The rejection letter. The fastest way to Amberfield Town is to go south from Echo Rock Town. Unfortunately, they're wrapping up their festival, leaving that route blocked. Another option would be to head south from Hades Town. Following that path will lead you through the Genesis Forest and take you to a route just south of Echo Rock Town. You head south from there to get Amberfield Town. Uh, I know it's a bit of a detour, but that will definitely give me enough time to come to my conclusion. If you get lost, just check your map. It should give you a clear picture of what I mean. Okay, so that's not so that's the bad news. Okay, so the bad news is that um, um, the bad news is that like. It'll take more time, and we need to now deliver this rejection letter. All right, so what's the good news? Good news is I finished repairing that hunk of junk. It's just waiting on the Arcanum. There it is. Wow, perfect size and everything. How convenient. Just got to set it in and the EXP router. Whoa, what is this? That device used to be an old Versus Seeker, super popular over in Kanto a few years ago. I was able to repurpose it into something even better, an experience router. Uh, EXP routers for short. It allows you to uh, your entire team to synchronize their growth rates. What I mean is, when your Pokemon defeats an opponent, it'll gain experience and share that experience with the rest of your team. I actually think it's. I think it. I like it. I, I like how it's like an in-canon um, EXP share that shares with your entire team that you can turn off. With a device like this, you'll be able to cut your training time in half. I know it doesn't necessarily help you figure out where you came from, but it'll make your travels a bit easier. 
Now, girl, off you go, a new XP router in hand, a clear destination, nothing can stop you. Bring that letter to the Safari Zone owner in Amberfield Town. By the time you get back from that delivery, we should be one huge step closer to getting you home. Sick. Uh, I'm gonna turn it on. Um... Oh, you can't turn it off. Okay, anyways. Um... I, I, I actually like, like, I initially was like, ah, oh, the EXP share for all your Pokemon, that's a stupid idea. I hate that. It's grown on me. Um, I don't have as much time as I used to in the world. Um, if I want to entertain you guys, too, as much as you guys say you love when I, um, uh, grind Pokemon, you don't. It's not, it's, no, uh-uh. <laughs> uh, it's more fun to see the story and everything. So, um, I actually really like it a lot, you know? I really do. Um, okay. So, let me fly to now Hades Town. We're going to go south to Hades and then go to Amberfield, which we have to cross through the Genesis Forest. So, we go from Hades to Genesis Forest over here. Cool. Tangentic, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Oh, hey, what's up? What's up, Teal? Hey there, Grill. I haven't made it very far on my quest. I end up helping the farmers wrangle up the Mareep. I've had a little bit of time to raise my team, though. Check it out. Okay. It's energy Egg, thanks for 100 bits. Dude, he looks so much more buff, like, in person. Oh, you have a core fish? Okay. Um, I'll use Fly on you, actually. All right, Vice Grip's fine. Damn, dude. Okay, we'll use another fly then. Oh, you bitch. Oh, you rage. Oh my God, a super potion. Are you serious? Lame, actually lame. We have the main cast's age yet? I don't think we know how old the main cast is. Probably young, I think. If anyone knows, that'd be awesome. Uh, Ivysaur. Okay, so you're gonna send out Ivysaur, and we're gonna switch into Nimbus here. Oh, we have to see what Cactus evolved into. Oh, that's badass, dude. Wait, that's actually so sick. Oh, I think I chose the wrong starter. <laughs> Cause we got Cumulus, right? Which is like kind of cool and all, but dude, Fucking cactus! It's grass ground type. Damn it. Uh, we have no counter. Oh, yeah, actually, we don't really have a counter. Uh, I'll use Foggy Strike here. It's not gonna do much. Um. Or maybe I bite, hope for a flinch. Rough skin? Wait, so if you do a physical move on Cactus, it does damage back to you? Okay, so it's like, it's rough skin, literally. I mean, that makes sense, but wow. Alright, I'll rock through here. Barbed Tackle. Okay, poison me. This is great. This is actually great. Hey, rocks 19. Faint attack. Um, faint attack 60 without fail. Um, and we'll use it instead of mimic. Yeah. Okay, um... Yeah, I do like I do like the XP router. Storavia. Oh, perfect. No, no, no. We're gonna stay in Rock Throw. This should be good. Nice. Let's go. Oh, we take those misses. I just love it so much when my Pokemon miss.
Hell yeah! That's fine. Wing attack's not gonna do much. Hey, level 20. Um, awesome. I wasn't prepared for that. Yo, is that easy speezy? The one, the only, the man, the myth, the legend himself? For a two-year resub? Dude, that means... I mean, you started your sub when I was half a year into YouTube. That's crazy. That means I was at, like, 4,000 subs. It was, either four, it was like 4,000 to 10,000 subs on YouTube. That's crazy. That's nuts. <laughs> and here you are. What, did you, get a, did you get 2 million yet? You're like right there, aren't you? Oh, oh, come on. Oh, that's so close. Don't do it for easy. Do it for me. Get that 2 million, you know? Like, come on. <laughs> like, come on. Get, 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 get easy. That 2 million. <laughs> On my way, you got it, you got it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so dude, you got this. That's so close. You're not uh um <clears throat> You're not even sub I've just <laughs> what do you mean? I've been subscribed, chat. I obviously fucking what, you know? <laughs> What are you- what are you talking about? It clearly says subscribe. <laughs> I don't sub to many people. <laughs> so, <laughs> so it's like, I also get Easy's videos recommended to me anyways. So it's like as if- cause like, it's like as if you sub anyways. So it's like the same thing. Oh my god. Alright. No, oh, that's not copium! Oh my god. Hey guys, do you guys want to stream? <laughs> Good battle! It'll be better next time. I think it's fate for us to be rivals. We can keep pushing each other. Um, I'm going to head up to Echo Rock Town to get my first badge. See ya! Bye, Teal. If you do YouTube drama with the easy, it might help. Right, um... Dude, I- Dude, uh, I was like, Easy Speezy's literally the worst streamer. Not only that, uh, but he makes such good content that it makes me jealous. And that's not fair. So, uh, you should not watch his content because, uh, it'll, after watching his, it'll make mine seem worse. So, stop watching his content. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, also fun fact. Hey, easy. We're all we're we're <laughs> Look, we have something in common. We're both not on NRG now. <laughs> That's actually like <laughs> Like we have something in common. Uh, Crow, what's your favorite game so far this year? I haven't played many. I, I I know it didn't come out this year, but it takes two so far. <laughs> oh, thanks, easy. <laughs> oh my god! If anyone's curious, um, there's like no actual like, I didn't, <laughs> dude. I ever, I always see like some comments or whatever. Like, yeah, actually, Easy Speezy left the Energy Speedrunning team because like something happened. You know, like between him and the rest, like something happened. Like. They don't really want to speak on it, but like something happened, and it's like, no, his contract was up. <laughs> that is, that's it. Like you know, he signed for you know, certain amount of months, and then, and then it was it. <laughs> just, I, mean, I signed for a little bit more months, and you know, that's that's why I'm not energy. You know, that's it. There, around here is Dusty. I think it's so funny. Miss playing games with you all. Yeah, yeah, it was fun. Uh, I'm gonna die here. You're electric type. Oh my god, drama? I know, it's crazy. You'll never believe what happened to Easy Speezy if we don't talk about him.
Uh, Spore? Why did that happen? Stun Spore didn't work. Oh, it didn't work on me because I'm already paralyzed. That's why. Mods, it says ask a mod before posting links. Do you mind if I post a Rickroll link? So, normally when you... Normally when you Rickroll somebody, you don't tell them you're going to Rickroll them. You know? You, you, you don't be like... Uh, hey, I'm going to Rickroll you, by the way. Can I, can I Rick, can I Rickroll you? <laughs> it's just like normally, like you just, you know, you just kind of, you just do it, you know? <laughs> uh, follow up on wait and double kick. Yeah, for sure. I can't play that much because it's DMTA. <laughs> uh, instead of beat up, beat up sucks. Um, Ponyta. Oh, yikes. Um, I'll stay in. I'll use uh, Rock. They're on Twitch. They're gonna press any links if I promise free Robux. Hey guys, do you want free Robux? Uh, if you follow my stream, you'll get free Robux. Skiddo. Cool. It, it confirmed. I guess, I guess none of you guys want free Robux. I understand. <laughs> oh, wow. It worked. That's so crazy. EV17 underscore. Can I get Primo gems? Uh, no, you fucking weeb. <laughs> imagine, imagine liking anime. Weird. That's so weird. I cr cringe. I it's not like I just showed you my entire manga collection or half of my manga collection. I don't even I don't even know what that is. I, I, like I I'm you know that's 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 a term I I learned from Twitch chat. Manga. I don't know what uh, it's is is manga some sort of fruit? Fucking weird. <laughs> what is this manga you speak of? Mango is the anime text and manga is the fruit. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Yeah, dude. Imagine liking mango. Cringe. <laughs> uh, are you familiar with the Pokemon Eevee? Yes. Pokemon has a different evolution for every single type. You name, you name a type, uh, there's an Eevee evolution for it. Rock, ground, dragon, fire, fairy, you get it. Pretty neat stuff. Oh. I'm looking for a Loudred. Uh, I want to train it for my Hunter. I don't have one. Oh, look, a sink. It's a sink. Pretty common house appliance. Yep. Large, solid, gray refrigerator. A clean garbage can. Almost like it's been never been used. The thing I... Okay. The thing I love about this Pokemon fan game, more so than like other fan games is that there's unique text for every kitchen appliance we look at. It's the smallest thing, but it's so wild. Dude, I just fucking love kitchen appliances. Hey, hi, how's it going, Abby? Speaking of kitchen appliances. Hi. <laughs> Thanks for the raid, Abby. <laughs> uh, that's Abby, by the way. She just raided me. Um, an IRL raid. <laughs> if you're not following Abby, um, good. <laughs> that's great. 
Uh, no, follow Abby on Twitch. She just started streaming, and she's on her way to get affiliate. She'll get there one day. I believe in her. <laughs> yeah, she just start. She just started streaming. You know. Uh, all we grow is wheat. How boring, mundane, tedious. An assault on my attention span. Jesus. Oh, um, I know. Just started. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, seven. Thanks for the twenty-three months. Oh my god. Uh, and Zach, thanks for the tier two for thirty-two months. God damn. Shout out to Zach, who was there before my YouTube channel even started. We were just talking about Easy Speezy, who was there, I think, right after my YouTube channel started, which is crazy. Um, if you're not following Abby, actually go follow her. She's fantastic. She's great, you know. Come on. We, we been know this. Um, but uh, if not, uh, you can follow me. <laughs> um, and, uh, yeah. Um, uh, we're playing uh, Pokemon Infinity, which is a fan game in which... We are uh, lost on an island, and we're trying to regain our memories. So currently we're doing, um, we're trying to fix this machine that can access our memories. And so we need to go over to the Safari Zone, uh, which is uh, south of us currently. It's like Pokemon meets Stardew aesthetics. It's, it's amazing, you know. I, I really love the aesthetics of this. Yeah, it's, got that, it's beautiful, dare I say. What if I unfollow you and then follow Abby instead? You know what we call that in the business? We call that a great idea. Um, all right, uh, skip. We'll switch over to Nimbus. I really want to level up Nimbus. Uh, and then I'll Powdered Snow. Fucking hell, dude! This is the worst day of my life. What is Nimbus? Uh, it's a Swablu. Nimbus is a Swablu. A normal ice type. Alright, this should kill because of lack of berry now. Alright, I'm going to switch because I, I want you to still get uh, XP. Seven, thanks for gifting us up to Viri. Okay. Um, and then I'll just foggy strike and we'll be good to go. Uh, trying to learn mist. Uh, no, I don't want mist. Nimbus is trying to learn gust, though. Dude, I'll take gust. Uh, actually, ooh, gust over peck, probably. Chat, do, what do we... Mm, or Gust over Roost? What do you think, chat? What do you think is better? Over Pack? Okay. Gust has more PP. I also have a lot of PP. For these sick dance moves! Whoa! Whoa! That was, that was that was a good joke, right? That was great. <laughs> yeah, we recently added uh Bedge and Wokej. Hey, chat, if you're gonna let people if you're gonna let people leave, at least people transplant, okay? Jeez. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. We'll head down farther. Uh, we need to go to... Oh, we can't go this way. Um, so, breakable object. A Pokemon may be able to smash it. Smash! Wait. I'm going to be late for my swimming lesson. Uh, this is usually the path I take, but it looks like a landslide has blocked the path. Oh, no. Uh, well then, how do we go to the south? Oh, oh, this way. If you want to go to the south, just be racist. Wait, um... <laughs> uh... <laughs> Dude, 
Jay Robinoid! No, 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 chat, let's focus on the tier 3 from Jay Robinoid instead. Thanks for the 28 months! Um, it's been nice to catch a streamer again. been super busy lately. It's always a treat to watch. <laughs> Thanks for that tier 3. Appreciate it. Can we get some blankies in chat for that tier 3 subscription? <laughs> uh, farming takes patience. A lot of situations seem difficult only because of the time it takes to complete. Uh, you can accomplish a lot if you just have patience. Uh, ooh. There's a TM over here. I'm Southern, what the fuck? <laughs> Yeehaw! Oh, <laughs> uh, wait, there's an Apricorn over here. <laughs> oh. Uh, Alright, we want this over here. Fairy juice. Nice. Yo, what's up, Alex? Thanks for the 36 months. Dude, what is with today and the long, like, the, the insane sub streaks? Jesus Christ. Uh, cheers for three years. That's fucking nuts, my guy. Oh, my God. Oh, we gotta hang out soon. I know you're not near me. But we gotta hang out soon. That'd be so sick. <laughs> we'll figure something out. Oh, my God. Thanks for the three, 36 months, my guy. Three years. Which is... I've been streaming for 39 months? Oh my god. Oh my god, chat, I'm old. I feel like... I feel like Atrioc right now. Oh! My hip! Oh, we definitely need something. Oh, he's sick. Uh, get away from the water! Uh, is that Marie? Okay, awesome. Don't let the marketing take over. Don't worry. It's not Monday yet. Uh, I will bite and then hopefully flinch. Alright, that's okay. That's fine. It's scam Sunday. Marketing Monday isn't here yet. Right, and then sell out Saturday. No, it's it's sell out Sunday. Scam Saturday. Nice. Uh send out Baneri. Uh we'll swap to weed, I think. Marketing Sunday. Um, and then bug bite? It's not gonna be much, is it? Oh! Jesus. Oh, yeah, we'll just bug bite again. Oh, speaking of which, yeah, sorry. I'm, I, I saw the guy saying, uh, watching in VR. By the way, cool. Hell yeah. Um, I need to get my VR set back, actually. Trey currently has it. Hi. Um, will... Hello. Did you still need help on that thumbnail? He asked me on the 15th. I feel so bad. Oh, God. Also, can I have my VR set back? Omega lol. <laughs> I'm so sorry for dono walling you. <laughs> oh, I feel you no. Know, it's like chat. It's extra bad too because I, t I I told him that if he needs something to help or the title help, I could I could just I'll just like answer him as soon as possible. Turns out possible as soon as possible is um almost 15 days later. Nice. We devolved into a Kakuna. Was this after the car? No, I got in the car crash. What, like the beginning of March, wasn't it? Chat, when did I get hit by a car? 
I have memory loss from the event. Like three or four weeks ago? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I got hit that hard. Alright, around there, okay. It's like the fourth around there, okay. What the fuck, you got hit by a car? Yeah. You should have seen the car. You should have seen the other car. <laughs> I stopped it with my hand. Yeah, you know, I got pretty injured too. How do you think I got this? You know. Some might say I'm a badass, but I think that's putting it uh, lightly. No, I actually, uh, um, I don't know if it's still, you can kind of, yeah, you can see the scar right here. Yeah. You see it? Uh, that's from the shark bite. Yeah, so before I got hit by the car, I was bitten by a shark. And that's where that came from. So. No, the, the real answer is uh, I was uh, I was driving with my uh, hand on, uh, uh, so I was driving like this, right? Like I had uh, my hand on the side and one on top, like this. Um, and uh, the, like this could have, like we ended up really okay. Like it's actually insane the more I think about it. Cause I had my hand right here, right? And then um, the car, I was T-boned hit driver's side like this so my um driver my my door caved in and so that's why is stream ending no <laughs> that's why uh i got this because the door impaled like basically pierced my arm i could have broken not only yeah my arm i could have broken my collarbone if it, if it hit like this right there yeah It's my left arm. Uh, but yeah. I'm not gonna, oh, I can't get down there. I want cut. <laughs> As an HM. Are you new around here? Pebble uh, Pebble Dust Cave connects back to Hada's town, but I don't think you can reach it from this end. Otherwise, you can head down the cliffs to get to Genesis Forest, which I think we're going to do. Glad you were okay after that. Yeah, it was kind of dicey. All right, how hard did the airbags hit you? I don't remember. The thing is, is like, you know, it happens in slow motion and then also really fast uh, at the same time. Um, I, knew, I don't remember what I felt in the moment, but I didn't feel much. Um, basically because I didn't really know it was coming. So then I just kind of got hit, you know? Um, yeah, because like Abby saw the car coming in, she turned to the left and was kind of like, like, oh God, you know, essentially. Um, so I didn't, she tensed up, so she got whiplash, right? She hit the door with her, with her head. Um, uh, and, uh, yeah, I, um. Uh, she hit the door with her head, um, but yeah, I didn't see anything coming, so I was like, I didn't tense up at all. And so, if you don't tense up, you don't actually like. Oh, was that a crit? No, I guess it wasn't. Uh, if you don't tense up, then uh, you don't really it, it, like you end, fend off better, which is why um, drunk drivers normally, when they get in car crashes, the drunk drivers are the ones that survive, which is shitty, but you know. Um, don't drive drunk, please. Um, that's, yeah. I don't think I need to say that, but still. Um, because, uh, they don't tense up. This has got a ton of chemical burns from the airbags when they got in an accident. Yeah, but at least, you know, they worked. Uh, I would rather get a chemical burn than, uh, die. So, Yeah. <laughs> Do, however, donate blood before you get drunk. <laughs> I, I, it was an unethical life pro tip, right? Like, if you, don't, if you donate blood, 
right? Before you get drunk, then you have to buy less alcohol because you have less blood. So then your blood alcohol levels are like higher, right? So it's either you put in more alcohol or you have less blood. It makes sense. Don't do that though, please. Please don't do that. The Pokemon on this ball, it won't be right to take without permission. Okay. Anxious butt, thanks for the seven months. Appreciate that. Uh, Bluey, thanks for the Prime Gaming. It's really bad life advice. <laughs> Why are you verified on Twitter? It's <laughs> a great question. A lot of my family have worked these lands for years. We don't venture out of our own bubble too often. We have a Pokemon that really deserves to travel more. If you're willing to take them, their Pokeball is sitting on the table. Oh, okay. The Chargo. What's a Chargo? What is that? Do you guys know? Is that a little yak? Should I name it Yak? Or do I just name it Chicken? It's like a Flame Bison. Looks like a Yorkshire Terrier. Okay, I'll name it Chicken. Okay. Uh, it's it sink. <laughs> it's a fridge. Who cares? <laughs> yeah, I just love seeing the six and fridge dialogue. It's so funny. We saw Professor Wormwood help you out of the forest. It seems like you're doing okay on your own now, though. So that's nice. Um. Okay. So this is. Oh, we're going there. At Pebble Dust Cave. We don't need to go here yet. Uh, we want to go to the right, I think. The more time you spend with someone or something, the more of yourself you give to it. So when you lose them, it's like losing a part of yourself. Dude, why is all the dialogue in this game, like, real? You know? Like, like that hits, man. Fuck. Okay. All right. I heard the Pokedex entries are fire. Um... I don't really know. Uh, let me check. Um, squirrel produces a small cloud as a tail that uses the float on top of and keep itself cool. You can often be found snoozing, sprawled out on their own cloud. War Turtle's body starts to develop in even more cloud forms, allowing it to temporarily hover sometimes. It uses the cloud as a cloak during foggy days. Cool. I think that's a Tumblr post, by the way. <laughs> okay, that's funny. Um, all right, so I guess we do go to Pebble Dust. Yeah, I think we have to go to Pebble Dust, yeah. All this deep talk just to see it sink. It sink! Pog you! What was the new Pokemon you got? We could head back if you want to grab the new Pokemon. What do you guys... I think we do. I think we grab the new Pokemon. And then we come back. I think it's worth it. Let's go see Chicken. Back to our house. Uh, that's not where chicken is. Alright. Um, actually, where's the... Is there a PC in here? Faint aroma of gas can be spelled hovering around the burners. Mocha W. A uh, large refrigerator that sounds relatively hollow. Right, right, right. I didn't know about the gas. Monka W, dude. <laughs> Alright. They're gonna die. Good to know. Good to know. Um, I'll just go to I'll just go to a Pokemon Center. Okay. Uh, PC, Thorns PC, and then we'll organize. Oop. 
Uh, organized boxes. Okay. So this is Chargo. Bashful. Often scatters things. Uh, really bad stats. It has F and special defense. Nice. Um, powers up moves that have recoil damage. It's really cute, though. Um, Smokescreen, Ember, Meditate, Headbutt. Yeah, I think we take it. It's a new Pokemon, so... Um, we do it instead of... No, Fall Out Boy. Instead of, uh, Goose. Particle Physics. Thanks for the 21 months. 21 months. You're crazy. You're insane. I'm glad you've been enjoying. Is this a Nuzlocke? Nah, we're just playing through it. Uh, doing doing story stuff, story beats. And, I, dude, you know I'm enjoying this. When I've been streaming for five hours, and I'm, like... Dude, I'm fucking loving this, man. Like, this is so cool. Uh, the Pokedex entry? Uh, let me see it. For Chargo. Oh, God. Can I... No. Chargo! There it is. That didn't take too long. A mountain Pokemon that is kept around villages to keep people warm. They are ditzy and must be washed uh, around flammable things. Oh, that's cute. Spiro, uh, right, right. And these are the other, uh, yeah. Cool. Now scroll back up. Oh, hey, I want to see Bulbasaur. Okay. <laughs> Alright, we gotta get this way. Uh, Doodle Dan, thanks for the $3.78. We said 21 months. 21 months? All I could hear was Uncle Roger. That is all. I don't know who Uncle Roger is, but I hope he's okay. Um, okay, let's go up here. But dude, you can't see jack shit in here. Can I like somehow flash or do I have to teach? I, oh, I can just flash like that. Okay. There it is. Saku let you. Thanks for the prime. Uh, I'm doing some professor for uh, some. I'm doing some research for. <laughs> I'm doing some professor for uh, for research wormwood. Did he send you to help? Um. Okay. Foggy strike. You just flash the cave. Hey, at least it's better than uh, Gen Five Pokemon, uh, where you go into a city and then in a dark alleyway, a man gives you flash. They knew what they were doing. They, like, they knew. If you want to see it, it's in my, um, Pokemon Black Level 1 video. Which, by the way, great video. I mean, I, actually, I'll, I'll be... 
Uh, I'll, I'll toot my horn here. I think you'd be hard pressed to find a bad video uh, in the past like six months. And I'm really proud of that. Like, I, you know, I'd argue maybe the um, Breath of the Wild blindfolded one, just because it's very technical. But besides that, yeah. Do you see Stanza's praise of you in his vid? Uh, am streamer, very vain. Oh, what is this? I know their dirty little secrets. Drama. <laughs> All right, Stance. What up, YouTube? We are back from the Slothathon and ready to create more absolutely innovative content. And by that, I mean we are going to rerun an idea we've already done and probably run it into the ground until you guys hate it. It is Twitch Improv based on YouTube thumbnails. If you didn't see the last video, the way it works is I have never seen these thumbnails. I am going to look at them live on stream and I am going to try and create a five to 10 minute video that would fit the thumbnail. One of these thumbnails was determined too saucy for Discord. Thumbnail number one. I know their dirty little secrets. Drama. Okay, this is a good thumbnail because it has different content <laughs> creators in there, right? You have me, the rising star. You have point a okay. nominee, a a nominee, Ludwig. So he has to make a video based on that thumbnail. Matriarch, of course. What would I do to make this a YouTube video? Okay. Bro, I'm also eating. This is a small break for me to, to eat. YouTube.com. I go to their channel and I watch their least viewed YouTube video. What's their dirty little secret? This is their video that did not have the sauce. What is their least popular YouTube video? The shit that the people don't like. You know what I'm saying? That's a dirty, dirty. Hey, it still has more views than this video. Let's go. <laughs> little secret. Oh. Ganon with only sticks. I completed the impossible challenge in Breath of the Wild. 56,000 views. Yuck. This is what we're doing oh. today. We're going to be beating Ganon. Oh, my God. Old video? 2019. And that's what we're doing. Why are we getting pants? Do you just... Oh, this is already a good video. I hate... <laughs> this is why Point Crow has millions of subscribers on YouTube. Because his worst video has already hooked me immediately oh he literally he hooked me here's what we're gonna be doing he signposted it we are gonna be beating ganon with only a stick and then what happens dun 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 dun, dun. he hits me with the law and order svu beating ganon with sticks only it is possible okay point crow point crow was a bad example i'm sure the others will have terrible youtube videos <laughs> something that they should be ashamed of wait his least popular video has a hundred and seventy three thousand. yo no shot wait actually wait Atrox, wait. Atrox's least viewed video has 173,000 views. There's no way. Oh, <laughs> that's a lie. <laughs> it's, that's, that's true. It's not true. The unlisted bad ones. Oh, it looks like he relisted them the eight years ago. Battlefield World War II was my attempt at creating a MOBA style game in the Empire Earth editor. Players enlisted on either the Axis or the Allied side. Game's equivalent of minions. Battlefield, World War II, and Atriox scenario for Empire Earth. Yeah, I don't think it just scrolls. I don't think it just scrolled far enough. I think you just need to scroll farther. Oh, it's because it only loads like a certain amount. His least popular video is better than my most popular video. Really? Sorry, I'm so interested in this. Wait, no shot? Well, I'm definitely not watching that. <laughs> Fuck that. That's a that's a shot to the heart. What could? Okay, no. Now I know that this is fake. This is not how you <laughs> find them. How do I find them, chat? There's no way that his worst video has 915,000. Could go oldest. Oh, this is huge. This is huge. Date added oldest. Yeah, 53k. 15k. Oh, we just gotta find it. 6k. Let's get an actual video though. Something that he created, right? Not just Smash Bros. things. Hacks is on the comeback. Parody of I Can Go the Distance. This is Ludwig's dirty little secret. With your hand you think we wouldn't find this, Ludwig? <laughs> I am Farron. Thanks for the 23 months. Oh, my God. <laughs> my fault.
fucking YouTuber, dude. Lemmick <laughs> was on every scambit to try and get YouTube subscribers, and that's so goaded. <laughs> He's singing Hercules parody songs about the Super Smash Bros. Melee community. Feel strong, man. Did you record this in a bathroom? This did not age well. Now that we know the oldest Gambit, we can go back to Atriox. Of course I know his secret. Battlefield World War II and Atriox scenario for Empire Earth. There it so is. For those of you that don't know, when Atriox was trying your gate. to get his five, out of five college, subs. Appreciate that. went back, found a bunch of games that he made as a 9 to 13 year old, and then dubbed over them to talk about game design principles. Check it out. Battlefield World War II was my attempt at creating a MOBA-style game in the Empire Earth editor. <laughs> While the game lacked an inventory, for starters, the game was very expansive. Players enlisted on either the Axis or the Allied side, and rather than just kill the opponent's headquarters, which was this game's equivalent of a Nexus, uh, one time, you had to beat them at least three out of four times on a variety so of World War II themed battles. And to be honest, it worked. He got a job. Stanza's hooked me. This is a really good Empire Earth scenario. Really, like, I like the I like the idea for the video. But you know what? It's great. He had heart. He had gumption, and he had hutzpah. So Atriox, dirty little secret, is actually something that made him what he is today. Ladies and gentlemen, that is YouTube improv video. Number Yo, one. Rhino on Horn, thanks for uh, four months. Thank you. <laughs> I paid them all not clickbait. This is so stupid. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay, okay, this is an easy one. <laughs> this is actually the easiest one of all. Cringe. Don't do this, chat. Don't do this. All time. Uh, let me get back. It's, it's, I paid. <laughs> I paid them all. Mods, editors, stands, VIP members. <laughs> Them all, Dude, I'm dead. Me. Mods, editors, stands.vip members. Everyone knows when you don't have funny jokes for improv ready, you just fucking give away money. So, ladies and gentlemen. Um, but yeah, uh, no, but like actual thing here. Um, uh, don't do this. Um, he's like fucked me over. He's we're not friends. If you if you see Point Crow and you immediately think Small Ant, stop. <laughs> Vice versa. If someone says Small Ant and uh. Uh, you immediately say something about Point Crow? Don't. Please. That's all I can ask. This is actually the gentleman. All right. I will PayPal. Cash app. Fucking Ethereum butt chug. $100 to whoever wins this. He's going to Ethereum butt chug. All right. Maybe that's enough of YouTube today. <laughs> maybe that's... Maybe we get back into Pokemon. Anyways, go check it out. Um, let me, let me, uh, we watched it on stream, so, uh, go give the video a like, right? Comment on it. I like this video. Um, let's see, what's a good... All right, anyways, go check out the video. All right. Um, and yeah, Rhino Horn, thanks for the four months. Uh, appreciate that a lot. Yeah, sorry. I, I saw I, I saw it. I didn't read the message until now. Appreciate it. The end is amazing. All right, I'll check it out later. Oh, yawn. Gross. Okay, um... Can I kill here? I can't kill. I don't want you to sleep, because I don't want to go back and, you know, be the team, so I'll just throw out my rock here. Ah, oh, come on! Sweet kiss? Stupid. Um, I'll just low kick. <laughs> Wait, low kicking a togepi is literally just bunting it. <laughs> like it's literally just kind of like, oh, bah. <laughs> it's like drop kicking an egg. Oh wait, I thought Togepi was normal type. Am I wrong?
Am I wrong about it? It's fairy type. What's good against fairy? What, like poison steel? Yeah, poison steel. Okay. Ah. Uh. Nice. All right. Uh, I just need to make it through one more without getting confused. Please. Fuck! Oh, it knows Trick Room too. Oh, God. All right, well, this Togepi's kind of wrecking face right now. Catch? No, this is a trainer. Sorry, use Trick Room. Skull Bash, yikes. All right, this should be good. Steal from the, catch the trainer. Okay, that's not, chat, that's not how that works. <laughs> you can't catch people. Not yet. Oh, it's not, it's not my Pokemon does like. That's what I'm trying to say. All right. Uh, let me heal up our Pokemon too. Uh, just so we don't have to go back. <clears throat> I smoke six packs a day. All right. You can catch feelings though. True. I know. One of these days, uh, I'd like to. I'd like to do that. Cringe. Uh, yeah, that'd be fucking cringe, wouldn't it? Imagine. <laughs> Losers. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> uh, alright, let me run. Just like I do from my feelings. Uh, my book would have great potential. Let me show you. <laughs> alright. Um, uh, I'll just bite I think oh no I should probably like um yeah bite I think that's good that works um oh it's like five hours in Jesus Christ if you're liking the stream you're not following the stream yet uh feel free to follow the stream you know uh we do cool stuff every every I don't know we're almost to a mil chat oh my god we're almost at a million followers on twitch isn't that crazy you could be the one million follower that could be you if you just follow now, yeah, if you subtract 600,000 followers and then fo and then and then and then you follow, you could be the 1 millionth follower. It's crazy. It's nuts. <laughs> Sounds fishy? No, also you get free free uh V-bucks if you follow me. Uh, don't check it though. Like it, it just it just happens. Bubble beam. Um I wanna learn bubble beam instead of hold back, I think. V-Bucks, but I want Roblox Ro Robux. Yeah, you also get Robux. Two. You get both of them actually. It's a two-for-one deal. It's me, Nigerian Prince, Point Crow. I know, I'm secretly a Nigerian Prince. Um... Uh, Weather Ball. Should I learn Weather Ball? It is Stab. I think Weather Ball instead of Roost, maybe. What do you think, chap? Uh, once we're out of the cave, I'll explain the story again, by the way. Instead of Roost? Okay. Uh, I like Sing. It's useful. Do you have a Hail Setter? I do not. That would be sick, though. The accuracy of Sing. It's 55. So what should we get rid of? Do we get rid of Roost, Sing... Or weather ball. 
or Gust. Weather Wall does have stab, yeah. I see a lot of people saying, would you like to know Weather Boy? Um, I'll get rid of Weather Ball actually. I don't know. I, I, I don't. I, I think we could. I think we could do something better. Uh, Ninjwowski, thanks for the three months. Um, I'll fly you. That'll be better. Uh, because we have stab and it's more attack. Or more power. Never mind, it's not very effective because it's ground type and I'm a loser. Sheesh. What's the lore behind the name Grill? Oh, it's really easy. That one's a, that one's an easy one. Um, I uh, I just one day uh, I chose a girl for my character and we named her Grill because she is one. Hope that helps. <laughs> That's literally the lore. We just did it. And then it happened to when we kept doing it. <laughs> You're welcome. What canonically is is Grill's dad George Foreman? Objectifying grills. <laughs> yeah, I. I like to. Uh, barbecue hot dogs on gr grills. Sheesh. I think. Uh, Rock Team? No, Rock Team sucks. Alright, chat. Wait, give me a second. Um... Pause champ chat. Sorry, I'm getting, <coughs> I'm literally getting things ready for Fortnite tomorrow. I wish that was a joke, but that's real. <laughs> um, okay, fire spin instead of, nah. We're playing, we're literally playing Fortnite tomorrow and Ludwig's, uh, Ludwig's hosting a tournament. Um. Yeah, Ludwig's hosting a tournament, uh, with a bunch, with like every big streamer, and we're one of those streamers. So, uh, we're going to be playing Fortnite tomorrow. Damn it, Sucker Punch got me. If you don't win your mid, um, I'll be doing it with, um. Purple Cliff, Sam Witch, uh, which I need to actually do right now. Purple Cliff, Sam Witch, and Linkus. All right, sorry. Um, I'll just I'll right, Hyperfang's fine. I'll just power snow and kill. What? Hyperfang's not fine. I lied. Nice. Uh, Fallout Bowie wants to learn Pursuit. 
Uh, pursuit instead of... Nah, I still have Fury Attack. Fury Attack sucks. King of Pilgrim, Pilgrim, or Pilgrims, thanks for the three months. Um, anyways, chat, well, I'll see you guys tomorrow for some Fortnite action. It actually, like, unironically sounds fun. I'll be real with you guys. I'm actually kind of excited. Oh, shit. Like, I'm just try I'm trying to figure out how we can, like, troll everyone. Still think it's fake? No, it's real. Um, I don't know if I'm allowed to say who's, like, a part of it, but if you think of Big Streamer, there is Big Streamer. Yeah, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 times 4 people. Alright, sick. Uh, we'll keep up Fall Boy. 60 streamers. Grand Fan, thanks for the Prime. Ah, uh, that's gonna kill. Yep. Yeah. Dude, all right, we'll send out weed. All of Twitch playing Fortnite at once? Yeah, except for you. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, that was me. <laughs> I was hoping for the poison there. Alright, I'll stay with Ryak here. We'll see if we can do this. This is actually like a hard battle for some reason. Oh, uh, one sec. Okay, the event starts Monday at 2 p.m., 2.30 p.m. Pacific time. All right, this is, this is, this is the details. Um, it'll be five custom matches in a row. Should be out like two to three hours. The longer you last, the more points you get. That's how it is. Okay. Interesting. Chat, do you think I'll win? No. <laughs> um. Hey, chat, do you think I'll win? Uh, put yes if you don't want to be banned. crazy how all of you said yes anyways let's look at what's happening on screen right now that weed is evolving when in doubt denial works it's a weed drill nice uh we are going to die why are caves just so extreme why are caves so hard in this Oh my god, we're literally gonna die. Oh my god, we're actually gonna die. Dude, I don't know. I gotta get more, I think, repels. I think that's the main thing, is I just need more repels. Also, yeah, the opponent's Pokemon are, like, insane. I think that's it. It's not me. It's the opponent. Go chicken. 
Oh my god, he's... He's so squishy. Oh my god. He just looks squishy. Oh, make the tune eight. Oh, cringe. Cringe. Oh, I'm cringing. Just do it already. We did it. Look, guys. We're slowly making it through the cave. Save me, dude. Save me. Uh, okay, we'll go. Hey, a hard stone. Oh, I'm not gonna beat you. Oh, there's no shot, dude. All right. Pico Sevens, guys. It's been a good run. It's been. It's been great. Oh, God. All right. One down, one to go. Unless I, like, somehow clutch it with a bug bite and then, like, one shot. Never mind. Whoa! Oh my god! Let's go! Wait, it's not over yet. It's over. It's so over. <laughs> yeah, alright. <laughs> alright, we gotta we gotta head back real quick. Don't even worry. Um, but before we head back, um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm just kidding. We're going to fly uh, to here, and we're going to grab some repels. I know, crazy how that is. Um, also, probably some... Oh, you have regular repels. Fringe. Um, and you also don't sell revives. Okay. Also cringe. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and absolutely decimate that notification bell. Alright, nice. Escape ropes? Nah, we don't need escape ropes where we're going. Back home on the range. This is a normal playthrough? Yeah. Uh, whenever I do a fan game, I just do a normal playthrough of it, just because I don't really want to make it too complicated. We're really interested in the story, which essentially boils down to uh, we lost our memory on this island, and now we're trying to explore it to get our memory back. Um, and so we need to go through this cave uh, to deliver... Um, so we need to go through this cave to um, a town to essentially deliver something so that we can build a machine to uh, regain our memory. To look into our brain. Hopefully that kind of makes sense. Um, and we'll do this. No, not medicine. Repel, 10. There we go. Is that a war turtle? Yeah, it's a war turtle that uh, stands on clouds. Uh, and that's part of the charm. Kind of cool. Oh, it's a Doug Trio. Cool. Frustration. Me in caves. Tag yourself. I'm TM21. <laughs> uh, okay. Yo, what's up, Lysel? How's it going? Okay, um, and then you are a guy with a hat, which we've already faced, and you almost decimated me. Um, and then there's nothing down here. Okay, I'm trying to explore all of this cave. Which I now go to the right here. Okay. Awesome. Let's do this. Come on, Hiker Brad. Obviously. Come on. Imagine being named Hiker Brad. Cringe. Rollout's actually awful. We need to hit this bubble beam. God. 
Okay. Um, first name Hiker, last name Brad. Uh, what? Oh, Mawile? What type is Mawile? Will the end stream award be allowed during the subathon? No, I'll remove it. Fairy Steel? Oh, really? So what's good against it? I'm assuming fire, right? Okay. Fire and ground. Alright, well, we definitely know uh, Ember here, so... And Intimidate. But we're using special, so we should be good. Oh, nice! Let's go chicken! And we got the burn! Let's go chicken! Fuck yeah! Easy! Uh, chicken wants to learn confusion? Uh, yeah, instead of... Yeah, instead of meditate. MKE, thanks for the two months of your prime. And Abugabugla, thanks for the prime as well. Uh, send Aaron next. Aaron is also steel, right? So. No, it's not. Aaron is not steel. Okay, I lied. I'll just keep using Ember here. Oh, crit. Cringe. That's fine. Come on, chicken. Nice. Oh my god, chicken got into two levels. Oh my god. Chicken, you're insane. Nimbus wants to learn Frost Breath. I think it's better. It's a better power. Yeah. Um, always. Wait. This always results in a critical hit. Oh. Yeah, over powdered snow. For sure. It's a better pow- yeah. Wait, Nimbus is actually like sick with it now. Chicken's evolving! Your chicken evolved into Burneram. Oh, interesting. Okay. I'm kind of down with Burneram. The Pokemon puts on, puts on some bulk after evolving as it learns to better control its body. They can stand still for hours, meditating. Interesting. Okay. Burneram's an interesting Pokemon. Oh, okay, sick. That was the that was the cave. Okay, so we were basically out of the cave. The Hayfield Plateau. Got a super potion. There's the Abra. Hey! Or an Abra. I don't know if it's the Abra. Fuck! Oh, I have made a mistake. What is down here? Oh, I shouldn't. I don't want to use another repel. Okay, I guess not anything over here. Okay. What is here? A black flute. Okay. Yeah, what's up here? Um, let me save. You've been at him for uh, five hours? Yeah, I've been playing this for about five and a half hours. I've been streaming for about five, five and a half hours. I've been playing this for about five. Oh, it's like a Pokemon Center. Okay. But I'm having tons of fun, so that's that's like the main thing. 
Uh, chat, would you rather I play, um, seriously, like, would you rather I play Breath of the Wild on Tuesday or continue playing this? Great ball. I'll get, like, two, three great balls. Would it be the mod thing? It would not. No, no, no. Uh, it would be, um, a Breath of the Wild randomizer, but it's, like, nine goals. The forest has four larger areas and a small clearing in the middle of it. Okay. Oh, this is Genesis Forest. Yeah, I'm also doing Breath of the Wild on Wednesday. Okay. I can always go back up. Okay, I want to explore this a little bit. Okay. Hello. I just ran out of the forest because I can't keep the bugs off me. I keep trying to throw water on them, but they don't seem to care about any of that. I'm living in a nightmare. <laughs> hey, that rock you're holding looks like it would be good for smashing bugs. <gasps> Our rock is useful. Okay. I don't suppose you'd let me have that, would you? And we hit it off the rock. Okay, sick, 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 sick. Thank you so much. I'll trade you for my Psyduck pail. It's good for taking care of plants. Hey. You'll need it for berry trees, but maybe you'll find another use for it. Okay, so we're on a fetch quest right now. This is this is a, a huge trade sequence. Um, pale that resembles Psyduck, usually used to water plants. Not effective against bugs, apparently. Sick. This one, this woman about to kill so many bugs. All right, some business things need to answer. Sorry about that, chat. Yeah, that's, that's what happens when I tab out. What is this? No? Oh, that's just, that's just the, that's just the ground. Okay. Oh, shit. Wait, no, fuck, wait. Wait, no! No, 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 no! Guys, guys, do I do I just state what we just did? Hey guys, do you want to go back to the cave? <laughs> Google is doing it. Thanks for the five five months. You want to save? Ah, that's all right. Uh, it's uh, we already know where we go. Uh, can we fly? Wait, actually, can we fly? Um, oopsies. No, okay. Uh, that's okay. The ledge next to the tree. Oh, no, we can't because... Yeah. Ledge to get back. Yeah, obviously. That's stupid. Imagine not thinking there was a ledge to get back. Actually cringe. Like, imagine being, like, that dumb. I wanted to do the cave again. Hey, put uh, raise your hand, chat, if you wanted me to go through the cave for a fifth time. Perfect. Sounds good. <laughs> All right, Genesis Forest. If you guys don't know the uh, significance of Genesis Forest, this is where we were found. Like, this is where we were found just lying in the forest. So, we're kind of exploring this now. I miss the old point crow, the fifth time cave point crow. Oh. Uh... 
Uh, I don't know where to... I think it's like a huge area. I, I know that. It's a huge area. So we're just gonna... Like, we're gonna head on over to Amberfield. To the, to the right. I just know that. And we're gonna do Animal Crossing. I did when it came out. I just haven't played Animal Crossing like since. Uh, not, not, you know, not for me. Um, it's a, it's a good game and all, but, um, I don't really, uh, I don't know. Um, it's, it's just, uh, I don't get relaxed playing it. I'm not touching you. I'm not touching you. I'm glad you're not. <laughs> Thanks, Rolf, for not touching me. I think. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, you're about to say the B drill. I'll actually switch to um, Nimbus for Frost Breath. Is that the cursed Pokemon game? In a way. Uh, so far, we're still learning the. Um, uh, we're still learning what's going on. Uh, no, Frost Breath. Uh, what? It didn't do much. Alright, well, I want you to gain levels, so I'm going to switch back to Tumulus. Um, I should have used, like, Dust. Anyways, what I'm trying to say is, um, we don't know too much about the story. So, um, once we know more about the story, then, then I, I can tell you if it's cursed or not. Um, but we've beaten, like, one of the five gyms. There's only five gyms in this. Um, and, uh, we're going to the second one right now, basically. Uh, all right, sick, dude. We got so many levels. Let's go. Uh, Kakuna, we'll stay in and then we'll fly. Yeah, if you wanted the story, it's uh, it's in the command right there. Good chat. Give us a lot of content though, including post game. It'll take a lot. Yeah, but Insurgents took me 70 hours. So far, we're five... Well, actually, we're five hours in. And we just finished the first gym. So, maybe this will also take me a long time. But, um... So far, seems fine. What do you do with people who don't like video games? I kill them. I cast them out. Having them fend against multiple wolves. If they survive the nights, I put them in a pit of boiling lava. And then spit on their corpses. Uh, we go down this way. Uh, real answer. I don't know. <laughs> I don't really care. <laughs> if you don't like video games, uh, that's cool. Like, <laughs> not everyone has to like video games. What was your first Pokemon game? Pokemon Fire Red. Uh, that was my first video game, too. Like, the one, the first one I owned. Oh, Cumulus wants to know Protect. Mm, I'm good. Yeah, sorry. Video games are bad because they, they cause violence. My bad. Sorry, chat. Oh, it's a Pikachu! Keep an eye out for obituaries of uh, lava and wolf-related deaths. Be very careful. A Pikachu! Hi, Pikachu! Right, Pikachu, if we give it, like, a water stone, apparently can evolve into something different. Uh, I want this Pikachu. Let's go! Yo! Is that... Dude, Ray Navaris? How's it going? That would be how it do. What were you up to? Oh, you're playing Kirby? Yo! Wait, that's sick! Hey, welcome in. Hi. How's it going? How is your stream? <laughs> Hi, I'm, I'm Point Crow. Uh, I mean, you already know that. But for, for people who don't, uh, I am Point Crow, and we are playing a, a 50 gifted sub bomb. What the fuck? 
Bro! I had a great stream. Enjoy the raid. Wait. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry, that's... You came in. You raided. Welcome in, by the way, guys. Appreciate it. Uh, hope you had a wonderful stream uh, at Ray's stream. Um, you came in, raided, and then dropped a 50 bomb. Thank you for that. <laughs> Thank you? Um, can we get some... Let's get some moos in chat. How about that? That's a good way to say thanks. <laughs> Anyways, uh, let me explain what's going on in my stream. Uh, well, I guess if you're following, if you're not following Ray and you came from their stream, uh, you should. Uh, because, uh, you, that's kind of how it works. Ah, um, I'm Point Crow and I am playing, um, this new Pokemon fan game called Pokemon Infinity. Um, I'll name the Pikachu rat because it is one. Um, and the story so far is we wake up in the middle of a forest and we have no memory of what happened. Uh, and we are essentially, and we have amnesia. We don't know who we are. We don't know our, uh, where we're from, how we got there. And we are essentially tasked with finding out um, everything. So we're going around the region, uh, this little island region. Let me show you. Um, this little island region trying to figure out who the hell we are and how we got here. And there's some mysterious, weird things going on. Um, and uh, our, the professor that we met has tasked us with building a machine to look inside of our memories and our brain. Uh, and uh, in order to complete the machine, we need to go to Amberfield Town and uh, get some parts from there. So kind of cool. Um, so if you like that, feel free to follow my stream. I don't know. Uh, fucking nuts. Thank you, Ray, for the raid and, and the 50 gifted. You're insane. And the art is spectacular. So I'm, I'm really enjoying it. There's some really, there's some cool uh, um, fake Pokemon, fake Emon in this. Uh, like for example, uh, this War Turtle, which is a water flying type. Uh, we named it Cumulus. Cumulus, uh, because it's a cloud, right? Uh, there's Rock. Um, that's Fallout Boy. It's a dark fighting Spiro. <laughs> Nimbus, which is a Swablu, a normal ice Swablu. That's chicken. It's a new Pokemon. Uh, Burnaram. Uh, and that's weed. Cause it was a Weedle, alright? It was a Weedle. Come on. Uh, we named it chicken because, um, we have a bad streak of naming all of our Pokemon after things that are not exactly that. You know. Classic. <laughs> so anyways, uh, yeah. That's, that's what we've been doing for the past uh, almost six hours. Is that a weed? I'm calling the police. Um, okay. Oh, does, does it affect cumulus? Wait. Uh, oh, it's probably like earthquake or something. Um, but yeah, that's uh, that's essentially what we're doing right now. And we've just been chilling. I've covered like past Pokemon fan games before. Uh, like... Uh, Pokemon Uranium, where your Pokemon get dipped in radioactive acid. Uh, then we also have covered Pokemon Insurgents, where you join a cult. Pokemon Rocket Edition, where you are um, a part of Team Rocket. Uh, there's a lot. We've done a lot, you know. Um, entrainment. Nance is to compel the target to mimic it, uh, making the target's ability the same as the user's. I don't want entrainment, yeah. Uh, and then we'll have Metapod, same thing. Insurgents is why. But yeah, I have videos on that if you want to check it out. Don't forget the gun one. Oh, yeah, I mean, there was a fan game that we played where we'd just take a shotgun to Pokemon. Like, the, the Pokedex was a hit list. That's a whole thing, you know? <laughs> uh, it was fun. I'll say that. It was definitely unique, too. Uh, but yeah, we're going through uh, the Genesis Forest right now. Speaking of which... Stay alert! The target is more likely in the area. That's... Interesting. That's exactly where we woke up. And these guys are checking out the location of where we woke up. They are elusive and quick, which shouldn't come as a surprise. If we can catch Celebi, its time-distorting abilities will give us the upper hand. Got it, Captain! That is unnecessary. You don't have to call me captain. Commander, what is our next destination? 
Okay, commander is a bit too a bit much. Uh, let's not worry about titles and ranks. And I literally just told you what the plan was before we got here. Have your partner fill you in if you can't remember. Affirmative. All right, let's move out. Keep an eye peeled for the time traveler. Damn. All right, so Celebi is involved somehow. Time traveling. I wonder where we time traveled from. And these maybe are time travelers too? Good one, boss. What? Keep an eye peeled like an onion because Celebi's head looks like an onion. Is that why it's considered a grass type? Enough. Well, we need to move. <laughs> All right. Beautiful. All right, let's save. Uh, and dude, this is... Dude, first off, the art in this is amazing. A forest shrine. There's a small empty space inside it. Yeah, and this is where we woke up. Celebi! That was... That was Celebi. That's Celebi's shrine. Yeah. Wow. Interesting. It doesn't... That, this also doesn't explain the weird dream we had where we were in a hospital bed and there was that ghost looking over us. Which, by the way, I haven't forgotten about that. It's really creepy. Really creepy. So we'll figure that out later, I guess. We found an awakening. Oh, that's funny because we woke up. All right, I get it. All right, it's a little bit on the nose. You seem to skip over that part of the story. I'm trying to keep the story super simple for you guys to understand. I don't want to explain like like 20 minutes every time we do it. Basically, we woke up in the forest and we're trying to regain our memories. Apparently, Celebi's involved. Interesting. Would you ever stream Cuphead? Not for me. Uh, I played Cuphead a little bit. It is difficult. It's, it seems fun. Not for me, though. <laughs> um, I, although, so, I mean, so, like, it reminded me a little bit of, like, a mixture, like, difficulty-wise of, like, Hollow Knight and Celeste. But, eh. I, I didn't enjoy it, like, as much as you would probably think. Uh, Chicken wants to learn Psywave. Um, targets attacked with odd psychic wave. The attack varies in intensity. Um, I like confusion better. The smoke screen's pretty good. Um, LJ Online, thanks for the one year. Welcome back. Oh, I don't want to switch. Forget. I should have switched. Um, I'll just bubble you again. Lemonade, thanks for the two months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, Nuzleaf, we'll keep in for the fly. Jesus Christ. The new Kirby game? Um, I might play it. It seemed like the new Kirby game, it seems good. For those who came in from Ray's uh, stream, yeah, I've... What do you think about Kirby? I'm curious. I don't know. Uh, I know my, uh, my manager, Abby, uh, was playing it earlier. It's a lot of fun. I saw RT play today, and I'm pegging. Yeah, RT beat it today, actually. Like, straight up beat the game. At, like, 97%, I think, completed. My glasses are fogging. That's funny. Mood. <laughs> like, RT works fast, yeah. You were rated, that explains the viewer count. Ooh. Um. You might want to phrase that a little differently. I was rated. It's a little rude <laughs> to assume. What the fuck is a DARPL? What is that? A friend? <laughs> Yo, Jeremiah, thanks for the tier two for 19 months. Thank you so much. And thanks for being one of my editors. You're super pog. Big pogs. 
I wish I had more for you to edit. <laughs> oh my god. I, I know, alright, I haven't posted on YouTube in a month, alright? I understand. Uh, I've been busy with other things. Uh, alright, sick. Super Nerd Ben, I couldn't see anything. It's because your glasses are fogged up. Uh, I want a Darple. Do I have to, like, fish for a Darple? Eric, feed me, I'm starving. <laughs> yeah, for sure, sometime. You can't use that here, okay. All right, I guess I can't fish. Yeah, maybe we'll go Team Rocket, beat him up, get a Darple. Good idea. I'm glad my trainer class went back into the game. Super nerd, Azzy. Fucking dead. There we go. All right, we should be good. Might be rare, so it has a low chance of spawning. That's true. Uh, but if we ever get a Darple, if we ever see one, mark my words, I'm catching it for you guys. We're doing it. Uh, Cumulus wants to learn Air Cutter. Um, Air Cutter is 1695. Um, Fly is just better. Okay, sick. Hey, we got iron. Uh, I can't wait to find some diamond later. And an elixir. That's cool. Um, yeah, this is really neat. It's like a weird open world part of... What the hell? Something invisible is blocking your path. Okay. Weird. It could be a Kecleon. It's probably a Kecleon. Brought back from Gen 3, you know? Like, it's like a, it's a dead drop, you know, dead, you know, uh, Gen 3 reference. It's the gross, uh, sorry. It's the ghost of Christmas ass, you're right. Okay, so we're back here. Okay. Uh, I just want to make sure that, um, I, I, I want to make sure that I'm discovering everything. Um, I really like to, like, in, in Pokemon fan games, I really like to see kind of, like, where things are. Because every now and then you'll come across, like, a, like a little gold nugget of the game that you wouldn't be able to see otherwise. So, that's why I'm, like, kind of scouting uh, around and about. Seeing what's here, you know? Is it too hard to swim? I can't swim. Um, we haven't learned how to do that yet. But we can fly. It's a little odd. I'm gonna ask a girl out, BRB. All right, I wanted to, I wanted to say something like mean of like, all right, I'm also eight feet tall and I'm about to go uh, compete in uh, the NBA. Uh, but you know what? Good luck if that is real. <laughs> Hey, you're a Twitch chat. What can I say? All right. You know? <laughs> Should I download this? Looks weird, but fun. I like it a lot so far. Um, but keep in mind, I've only played through uh, five and a half hours. Um, and um, I've only done like the first gym. Uh, there's five gyms. So about like a fifth. Uh, so take that with a grain of salt. Uh, but if you seem to like it, then hell yeah. Give it a try. Not gonna stop you. That's fun. Eric, please give your dating advice. Uh, my dating advice is to stop dating. Uh, don't. You're 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 uh, making the pool smaller for me. So. <laughs> so, if you could kindly stop until you know I work something out, then then that'd be that'd be sick. It's like, it's like my same advice for streaming. 
of like, hey, I want to start streaming. Do you have any tips? Uh, stop. Uh, don't, don't stream. I don't want competition. So, thank you. <laughs> Eric, how did you get the physique of a god? You know, I get that question often. Thank you for asking that, by the way. Uh, I get the question often, and uh, honestly, uh, just some good hard work and, uh, well, genetics, I'd have to say. I I'd, I'd really say genetics because uh, you won't be able to match how I am because I'm just so buff um, and strong and sexy. Uh, so, you know. You know, it's like, you know, it's like Crimea River. Build a bridge. Get over it, right? It's not going to happen. Do not disturb the environment of the bug Pokemon. Oh, I shall. Yeah, I'm most importantly, like, you know, out of all of my traits, my favorite one is that I'm, I'm really just most importantly humble. Right? I, I think that's my, f that's, that's my best trait. Out of all of the great ones that I have, I'm just, I'm really humble. So. Ah, uh, low sweep. Uh, do we want? Low sweep's pretty good. Double kicks. Uh, it's actually it might be a better speed stat. Uh, we'll do it set pursuit. Two lies back to back. I've never lied in my entire life. Come on, guys. <laughs> Three, are we going for four? Uh, Cascoon. Uh, we'll stay in for Cascoon. Lazy Faz, thanks for the two months. Appreciate it. Hey, Eric, she rejected me. All right. Birds fly. Water is wet. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm so sorry. I said, I said so mean. No, I, I don't. I hope you're okay. I, I hope you're okay. Oh, uh, that's that's a lot to go through. Hey, we got a revivaler. Penguins, Eric. What is penguin supposed to mean? Oh, birds that don't fly. Oh, whoa! What is this? Magnemite. Yo, what the hell? No. Oh, yo, yeah, dude. What is, what is that? Oh, so we have to like, okay, wait. I think I know what this is. Uh, we have to find the Magnemite. We have to chase it around the forest like five times. All right, so what it, what you're saying I need to do is just uh, uh, repel it. I, I want it, chat. I want it. All right, where's the where's the second place that it's at? It ran this way. It's over here. I found it. Okay. They ran to the right now. Like the far fetched thing in Harkle Soul Silver. Um. Why is he green? That's what I want to know. So it went this way. Am I right about that? Or am I wrong? Yeah, it's like grass steel. Oh, I can't escape. Oh, is it faster than me? Is that why? Probably. Chat, wait, how do I catch this thing? Like, how do I catch this Magnemite? 
Genuinely. Just find it with a Pokeball. All right. I, I, you know what? I regret asking Twitch chat. Na name a better duo than Point Crow asking his chat for advice and then, and then chat being absolutely useless. Yeah, it's gone now. It's still, it's not here. Like where where are the spots it could be? I'm asking I'm also asking you guys like you would have known where it is. Because you definitely have played this game before. <laughs> Fuck! Super nerd stand. You ask dumb answers, you get dumb questions. That's sorry. Fuck! You ask dumb questions, you get dumb answers. Uh, all right, all right. I might not be the smartest uh, toolbox in the uh, in the tools, but I I try. All right, and that's what matters. What really matters. Uh, drowsy, we'll keep in and we'll use bite. Yeah, English isn't my first language, guys, all right? Come on. You guys know that. What's your first language, then? Twitch chat. White people happy. N <laughs> Nerge. <laughs> I speak in gamer, actually. My first word was white people happy. Now it's not in there. Yo, I don't know where this thing went. Maybe down here? <laughs> First word was probably poggers. No, that was my second. First first word was white people happy. Second word, poggers. I guess we'll never get grassmite. I want to find grassmite, whatever that is. Can I also leave? Can I escape this, please? Yana, please. Fluent in Twitch chat, gamer and weeb. Uh, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. There are some things I, I, I am and some things I'm not. Weeb is not one of them. I don't even know what anime is. I've never heard of it. Shush, I'm hunting an elusive Pokemon. You ever hear of Kidfoot? Some people don't think it's real, but I know it is. Okay, all right, man. Uh, I guess we go up this way. The first times I heard you say wide people happy, I swear to God, I thought you were saying white people happy. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Um, what's over here? Oh, hey, we got a, a Pokemon Center. Yeah. Okay, nice. Uh, with all the money from my parents, I can just buy strong Pokemon. For some reason, I still can't beat the Echo Rock Elder. And we got a Soda Pop. We just literally took his soda. Nice. You can buy another, you're rich. 
You ever see one of those grassy magnemites? Yes! Yes, yes! I hear if you plant a seed in its head when it's older, it'll grow a small tree. All right, we gotta come back and get it. I'm looking for a sea king. Wanna trade it for my... Ah, oh, I don't have that yet. Palkin Trail. All right, so we're going to uh, explore Palkin Trail next time.